right, we're checking out the only game where you can run two million miles in an hour, punch the earth in half, and lift the entire known universe. It's Roblox. All right, we're checking out the only game where if your wallet is big enough, you can become strong enough to lift the entire known universe. It's Strongman Simulator. You will notice that I, the Florida man, am unable to drag a single toilet. Why? That is because I have not yet used my credit card strongly enough. So in Strongman Simulator, you start out as this being with the intent that you will eventually become strong enough that people look at you in fear and horror. Now, fortunately, I don't really have to do very much because I can just violently slam my credit card into the problem. <laughs> May say to yourself, Gray, why do you have a levitating ghostly rubber duck next to you? I really don't know. Same reason I have this, this toilet cleaner. They give me moral support, okay? This is unbelievable. I worked out for 20 seconds and I'm swole. Well, I'm about as swole as a bunch of violently churned pancake batter. Just like I said at the beginning, when you're out of energy, the best way to take care of this is by slapping your tiredness away with $100 bills. <laughs> okay, let, oh, VIP. Gain 2x while working up 50k energy, exclusive nameplate. None of that matters to me except for the energy. Bye. Oh my god, this is a really abusive nameplate. I originally had an alligator named Gluten, but the game took him away from me. I assume he was deemed far too powerful. Now all that matters is how many how many toilets can I realistically grab with me and drag across the finish line? Oh, toilets weigh nothing now. More! If I, if I grab all this stuff and I just drag it with me around the entire environment. Can I murder people? Look, it just seems like an unbelievably dangerous way to do things. Like, can I pull this guy backwards with my toilets because I have more toilets than he has? I might actually be able to help him if I if I utilize my toilets to grab a, what in the I am dra I am I, my head has fallen completely through the planet. Welcome to Strongman Simulator. Why does it work that way? None of us really know. Pull the dumpster out of the way. Go to the next world. You know, I'm taking this dumpster with me. I love it. <laughs> you actually can. If I drag this across the finish line, do I get additional points for this? No. This dumpster is the first friend I've actually made in this game. Sit up here in the bleachers and cheer me on. I feel weird because now it wants me to drag real items. Sure, give me six tires. I'm not so much dragging the tires. I'm using something out of the poltergeist. No joke, I'm legitimately floating. I'm like an overhyped strongman messiah. I can actually drag three tires. You know what works a lot better? Utilizing money. You can even walk faster in life if you pay for it. Normally you would drag these protein shakes to the end, but I just want them with me. Is there any other exercises besides <laughs> squats? On the plus side, just doing squats for another 10 seconds allows me to now drag six tractor tires with me. The thing that bars my ability to move onward is a 40 foot long protein bar. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Was that a turkey? Now I want to know what the most ridiculous thing you can drag is in this game. Don't worry, dumpster. I haven't forgotten about you. Come with me. All right, become friends with the protein bar. You guys have exactly the same ingredients after all. Okay, so you can grab a sushi, a soda, a, a thing of fries, just a whole pie, or a 30 foot tall turkey. Oh my god. This is idiots. This feels like one of those games where the numbers just don't matter. What I mean is you go from spending, you know, like a hundred energy per lift to a thousand energy per lift, and then you end up gaining like 12,000 energy just from moving one turkey across the finish line. Actually, I have an idea. Two times workout strength, eh? Also, there's a 10 times gift just like sitting over here. It doesn't really say 10 times what, I just know it exists. Does this give you 10 times the energy? Oh my God. You know what I love? Multiplication. Come here, turkeys. All of you beautiful birds are coming with me. Oh my god! Out of the way, deep fryer. Don't worry, dumpster. I would never leave you behind. I love how moving the dumpster, it basically takes nothing now. The dumpster just rapidly flies anywhere I go. Can I do this even faster? Times 10 workout speed? Sure. Oh my god! <laughs> ah! Kind of ripped, strong ripped, massive ripped baby fitness. Look at all the things we're going to make a fitness massive. Heavyweight, 
gamer bod, weak man, strong, strongest. I'm strongest, the majestic. So, um, yeah, that doesn't seem fair at all. Okay, I'm, I'm starting to become so big that I can't really fit on the level anymore. What am I grabbing now? What are these, basketball games? Yeah, whatever, give me all of them. You know what, give me all these too. In fact, just give me everything. Yeah, pool tables, why not? No one's gonna be able to do anything in this game. Oh my god, look at it. <laughs> Woo! Okay, let's uh, grab this arcade game and move this over here effortlessly. Come on, buddy, you can do it. My best friend. It's so big. I'm so big I can't actually grab the... <laughs> Hold on. I'm so big I can't grab the dumpster anymore. Open the drawbridge, you say? So does the auto workout work out as fast as I, Greystill Plays, can hit the buttons, or is it like faster? I'm just using the power of AI now to get stronger. Oh. My. God. Weak, gigantic, gigantic, spicy, gigantic, massive, gigantic. How many different things are there to get? I was a legend for a moment. Okay, I think I finally used up all of my energy. I landed on weak bear. <laughs> yeah, this looks fair. All right, let me just grab all these tractors here. Actually, again, let me just grab everything. I can't even see what I'm grabbing anymore. I got five million points for doing that. Do you just get five million each time about? Oh, you sure do. Grab the drawbridge. Pretty soon, I'm not- I'm gonna be so big, I'm not gonna be able to make it through the drawbridge. You know what, hold on. Let me just see how many of these I could just go through. Out of the way, wall! Okay, now things are starting to feel a little bit heavier, at the least. This dragon spider robots. I have found something that I am not strong enough for. You know what that is? UNACCEPTABLE! Hmm. There's one thing I love, it's watching numbers go up with no end in sight. Chattest! I have to show you something real quick. Now, it may just be me, but I'm not sure if this is the healthiest way to do squats. We don't need elbows! Where we're going! I just got 16 million energy. What? Oh, Workout yeah. times four? Oh, what? Why didn't you say that in the first place? <laughs> Oh, um, I may have broken something important. Doesn't look like I'm working out. It looks like I'm about to use this to murder someone. I'm a planet eater. It's one of my favorite food groups. Imagine walking down the streets of Florida and just seeing this monstrosity. Just like a 30 foot tall guy with a mullet. I've lost, I, I've gotten rid of humanity now. Now I'm a nugget. I'm a big nugget. I'm a golden nugget. <laughs> Can I get rid of this thing yet? I want, I want more stupid numbers to to occur. I'm actually just dragging a person on a turntable. I love that the speakers are still plugged in as well. Like they're still doing speaker things. Oh, you actually do squats with speakers now. They're not even weights anymore. A weak bulldozer. I don't know if that's how bulldozers work. Now, if we look over at the leaderboard over here, we can see that someone is at 190,000 strength. That's not gonna stand. I'm done with this disco out of the way. Oh. Planets. I'm literally lifting planets. Now, is this Earth? Oh, it's Pontus. One of my favorite non-existent planets. This is like what you would get if Saturn was copyrighted. Uh, squatting with some planets. Nothing to see here. I love that it's just planet. They couldn't even be bothered to give this one a name. I'm in diabetes world now. I'm dragging 300 ton lollipops across the finish line. Getting 148 million energy to do so. What? Lifting cupcakes. I'm still managing to get through these boards after having, you know, done almost nothing except, you know, 250 squats my whole life. How much is a canister of, of antimatter worth? 84 million energy. Doing squats in between blocks of plutonium. You may say to yourself, Greg, you mini gargantuan, what on earth are you doing? I'm dragging two gigantic containers filled with the Hulk saliva. I, I really can't imagine what else could weigh this much other than that. This is like the, an the, the, the anatomical fluid of a black hole. Bam! 72 million per vial of black hole blood. What else do we have here? A potion. A potion of what? It just looks like 
Radioactive urine. How much is radioactive urine worth? 78 million. I kind of like radioactive urine more than black hole blood. Now we've got the whole gamut. <laughs> This is, this is just fluids from a ton of different things. 65 million, but they're kind of easy to drag. I think I'll go with more of these. And I thought that science class would never get me anywhere. Oh, yeah. Now I get to work out with a, a couple of tesseracts over here. Chunky Bronto! I am a very rare species known as the Triceratonk. <laughs> The Triceratonk went extinct early in its dinosaur career because the only things that it ate and drank was Bud Light and Cheetos. I am not even slightly prepared to give up dragging these three barrels for 84 million apiece. Eventually, it's going to get to the point where I don't even utilize millions anymore. I'm waiting to the point where I can just have billions for my energy amount because we're not stopping that 42K up there. We're not stopping until that's higher than anyone else in the game right now. So I at least have to beat 190,000. I want to beat 300,000 realistically. We might as well, we might as well try in like one and a half times what, what everyone else has. Well, this is bad. My vials are caught on the side of this nuclear reactor that they decided to put right in the middle of my workout room. I've reached past manhood. I'm just a substance now. I am obsidian. Oh, this is, this is actually my land. It's just Florida. This is really bad. Myself and Cool Zombie are getting our balls tangled together. Actually, a very common issue with people our size. What are in what are what are inside of these beach balls? Each beach ball is is it's 88 million. I told you we'd be measuring in billions. <laughs> it's 88 million per beach ball. There's like a there's like a tiny galaxy sitting inside of each beach ball. That's why they weigh so much. It's the only answer I could come up with. The numbers in this game are getting so out of touch with reality. I'm almost halfway. I can literally see a volcano in the distance. Please tell me that I'm eventually going to be lifting an entire volcano. It looks like the Derp Rex is chasing me. I'm actually just dragging it. I've been dragging dinosaurs to their death. I have five billion energy now. Do I ever go past obsidian? Is this the pinnacle of power in the universe? Is there anything more? Also, why, why am I weightlifting baby dinosaurs? Oh my god. The entirety of Pangea can't stop me. I don't need your retro board either. Christmas, not on my watch. I am now dragging gigantic anglerfish and moray eels who have lost the will to live. <laughs> they don't even stay up for it. They're just like, whatever, great. Just get this over with. There's only a few more areas left. I have 12 billion energy. What will this get me to? Will I eventually catch up? Gigantic anchor, Wild West alcoholic barrel. Oh, it's just a living room. What are you, uh, what are you doing over here? He's like, well, since this speaker is right next to me, blaring at like 10,000 decibels, I'm currently going deaf. Excellent. I'm dragging this wardrobe, but it would actually be kind of funny if there was someone in it. 140,000 strength. I love that the most advanced part of working out is now moving for someone else. Effectively, I'm I'm that one friend that you call up to help you move just because I have a pickup truck and a really good back. Although considering I'm yanking glitchy janky beds from one side of the room to the other, I don't know how long my spinal column is going to stay in one spot. Also, I just have to mention something while I'm dragging these danger barrels to get a little bit more points. The cactus in this game are alien cactus. That is not what a real cactus looks like. It's more like a murder tool than a plant. I understand a cactus is normally kind of a murder tool, but these ones have evolved beyond that and they're o they only exist to, to kill people. Hope you weren't too attached to this door. The dude's like, I'm not. I've actually been locked inside of this room for the past six years. Mmm. Dragon delicious stacks of gold coins. Oh. You literally lift treasure. I'm lifting someone's retirement funds. I love how the pet that you can have here is a treasure chest. That's the pet. 22 billion energy. I'm not stopping now until I get to the end. I might as well. 180,000. 190,000. <laughs> 
200,000! I may be one of the strongest entities in the known universe, but it's not enough. Your rainbows can't stop me! I'm just dragging decorative gazebos now. How much is a decorative gazebo worth in- in energy points? Oh, you know. 700 million. What's crazy and you might not realize is that I know we've been getting larger as I've been doing these workouts. So that river that I just crossed is like 70 feet deep, but it only comes up to my ankle. You'll understand when we're done with all of this, we're going to go back to the very first board so you can hold on. Let me grab one of these. We're going to go back to the very first board so you can literally see just how gigantic the character has gotten because the boards have kind of been growing with us. I'm going to turn into Godzilla. I'm going to be Grayzilla. That's what people are going to see when I go back to Tiny Town. Imagine if Godzilla had a fantastic mullet. That's that's what you're going to see. It's like Floridian Godzilla. I've learned something absolutely stupid in this game. Everything is multiplicative. So when I have the times five workout and the times two workout and like the additional times two workout that I get, the gazebo is now worth 1.4 billion points. 6.9 billion energy. I'm about to get 100 billion energy. It's gotta be the Rocky Balboa pants, 100%. Numbers don't matter anymore. Right now, while I'm working out, there's two areas left. And I have to know why the sewer area is the final area. Considering I've already lifted planets with absolutely no effort, and I'm now passing 240,000 strength. I like how the weights are coming out of either side of my mouth because of how large I am. I'm vomiting the weights up. <laughs> Effectively. I'm also just I'm squatting literal buildings now 300,000 strength 345,000 is where we're gonna stop at I think yeah 347 I've reached the kitchen, but the door is already open. Okay What is the value of a toxic slime barrel going across the finish line? How much more can they possibly give a human being? Two bill, two point like six billion. I wanted to teleport back to the starting area. <laughs> Look at the size. This is another person down here. <laughs> the other reason I came back over here was to see. There's my tiny little dumpster. I don't just grab turkeys anymore. I vomit them toward the end. Well, I started as a sad noob, and now I'm the most powerful person in the entire universe, and I'm the size of this city. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Strongman Simulator. The next time, stay foxy and much love. All right, we're checking out the only game where the best way to get from Florida to Australia is to punch a hole through the center of the earth. It's strongest punch simulator. This is the happiest day of my life because I finally got my mustache back. Every great Florida man begins as a frail human. I love how it says I'm neutral. You know how there's like chaotic neutral? I'm more like chaotic stupid, but whatever. My job is to punch through absolutely every... To punch through absolutely everything until I get to the end of this. Now, as you can see, Right now, my fist just barely manages to core the smallest dents into the earth. Rookie numbers. They may say, but great, how on earth can we possibly get stronger faster? The answer is always the same: money and protein. Uh huh. Times five. How much? How many of these can you buy? Oh my God! This this stops eventually, right? Like you, you get to the point where you can't buy these anymore, right? Uh, you know what? Let's just try 10. So, uh, how much stronger am I? Okay. Uh, this kind of feels like violently cheating. <laughs> I'm already one punch Florida man. I just swing my fist slightly and half of the planet disintegrates. Look at it. Now, one of the things people do is they just leave their donut holes all over the place. And you can just take them and eat them. Now, you guys aren't using them anyway. Give them to me. Please tell me the best way to get to the next level is to just punch it. It is. Oh, fantastic. I'm in dollar store Minecraft. I'm now an average human. Safe zone. We don't need safety. Where we're going! 100 power per punch. So it's not so much donut holes anymore. It's kind of like the entire donut box. 1,000 power per donut hole. Hello there, super demon child. Would you like to be my friend?
Apparently not. Now I have a reason to gain limitless strength so I can punch people to death. All right, remember how I said I wasn't even sure if I wanted to go any further? We're going as far as this can humanly go. Times 50, you got it. The fact that this keeps going past 100 is blowing my mind. Times 500? Yes, we are literally at times 100,000. How stupid is that? <laughs> One million power? Six million power. The fact that I have a cape while also still being the Florida man is blowing my mind. It looks like I took a towel out of the bathroom and strapped it around my neck. Anyway, urgh, guess we'll travel to the next area now. I literally punched so hard that it blasts me off the ground now. 30 million power when I get upgrades. I am starting to just perspire blood. All right, I'm just blowing through these boards right now because now we need to see if there is an actual limitation to what your strength can do. Punch effect A. Okay, so now my punch is just flaming death. That's nice. 1.229 billion. I'm gaining 84 million power per hit. Each orb, 210 million. I still have not gotten to Australia. I upgraded to 100 million because I'm an idiot. What does 100 million look like? <laughs> oh my God. Does that, how much is it? What was it? Was it 336 billion power? Oh my God. When I punch, the power of the entire Lucky Charms franchise comes with me. Look at the height I can jump now. No big deal, just another 3.6 trillion power. All right, we're rolling through this now. Out of the way, I don't need your orbs. Actually, I'll, I'll go ahead and take the orbs. I love that after all this, I'm just a trainee class hero. I can end worlds by breathing on them. <laughs> Oh, epic music, I'm falling through the universe. I have literally fallen through time and space because I'm at 99 billion power right now. Uh, uh, am I allowed to? Oh, I'm a rookie class hero. They're slowly giving me more clothing, but at least I get to keep my mullet. You can have a mythical pet. What is it? It, lo it looks like, it looks like nothing. Do I really need, oh, oh my God, it is the power of the phoenix now goes through the entire universe when I punch. Yeah! I can stand all the way like back here and my punch goes through the earth. I am at 11.9 quintillion power. We don't need math where we're going. 16 quintillion power. Uh, yeah, next world. Oh no, someone brought me into a neighborhood. This was a bad idea. Oh God. Oh. I just evaporated half of an entire city block, like by accident. Oh, I now double fist my punches. Excellent. I'm an F class hero. That's about what I would get typically in Spanish class. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go because I keep rearranging the planet. How many different insane numerics are we gonna have to come up with? Also, I'm moving really fast now. Oh, I ended up in Canada. This isn't where I wanted to go. I wanted to go to Australia. All right. Mm, Canada orbs. Oh, hey, I can buy a pet. Damage multiplier times 15. Okay. Did I really need more damage? Oh, there's another person here. Hi. Oh, sorry, bro. Wait a minute. I'm not sorry. That gives me negative reputation. I love it. I remember the first person I met punched me so hard I died. I will remember that for all time. You turned me into a terrible person. Times 25. Times 37. Oh, I'm an E-class hero. I'm slowly moving through the entire alphabet. All right, where, where's the off-ramp to get out of Canada? Oh, found it. Great, I'm in Arizona now. I love how it just keeps adding random numbers to my punches. Wow, look at the height. I can blow things up from way downtown. Look at this. I'm on top of the planet! Ah! <laughs> oh, I don't even need to do this. I can just walk to the end of the planet now. <laughs> oh, really? We're gonna do this the proper way. By cheating! I'm on like the surface of the moon now. 
Oh my god, the amount of orbs you get is ridiculous. Uh, so what is my... <laughs> um, so that's a number that, um, that I have now. So this is what your pet starts at, and this is what it is now. It's an angry ice cube. I mean, if I hit this wall, what'll happen? <laughs> oh no! I mean, I guess... I'm just gonna keep pressing buttons until it makes me stop. These are numbers that should not exist in this game. I am now mixing various elements into my punches. Look at the numbers. Look at the numbers. What does it even matter? Sorry, man. I told you because I was treated poorly the second I got into my life. <laughs> now everyone's going to pay for those bad decisions. <laughs> I love that my ice cubes now have demonic horns on them. Bigger demonic horns. Go! 15 trillion. 15.5 trillion. This is where we are now. I can jump literally out of the entire map. Hey, I'm sorry. I'm a meanie now. I have determined I will be the worst human being to ever exist in this entire game. More pet power. I have no idea what this is, but I'm here for it. This makes me sad. There's no one here for me to murder. Oh, wow. I can jump across the board now. Just across the entire board with the power of my punch. Ugh. All right, let me aim up and bam. This is beyond one punch man stuff at this point. The craters that I can put into the planet are absurd. Holy orbs. Uh, what are those numbers? I right, am still only a B-class hero. I love how the higher in hero ship I get, the more colors forcibly attach themselves to my Florida man gear. My aura may grow, but I will forever be the Florida man. <laughs> more pet power. Oh, my pet is now the devil. It's literally just the devil. Oh, it's the devil and his brother. Antarctica, where are the penguins? No penguins? Urgh! I'm now an A-class meanie. Let me hold my hands up in prayer. Oh, gods of punching, give me a face with which to strike. Oh, I'm drop kicking things now. Oh my God. Oh, one hit and I go through the entire board just about. Hi there, orbs. Um, you will get fed to Satan, my best friend. It's kind of like a dog Satan is. Satan powers, activate. There's a lot of colors coming out of me, man. Uh, I just have to check something real quick. This is where I started. Uh, if I punch someone here, am I a bad person? just destroy the entire planet. Pretty normal jumping power. No big deal. I can still bury it. Look at the size of the damage. Hey. No, Where are you God. going, buddy? Come here. Just this one time. <laughs> oh my God. I'm sure he's fine. He's fine. I'm, he's fine. Wow. Huh. Well, I mean, on the plus side, I'm giving him a lot of free orbs. Everywhere I go. Oh, I got plus reputation for that. I guess they were a bad person. Huh. I kind of kill everyone indiscriminately. I didn't think this would happen. I'm an S-class hero now. I'm getting 102 whatever per orb. Sure. I feel like I'm going to be pressing this button a lot right now. Imagine just walking through the mall and you see this. On the one hand, I'm, I'm literally just wearing a tank top and Rocky shorts with a mullet and a handlebar mustache. I think I've gone back to the prehistoric period. I've actually punched stuff so hard that I've gone back in time. What are these? I am triple wielding punches now. The ranks are going up constantly. What is happening? I have found the diamond of unbelievable cosmic power. Wow. Uh, hi. I don't know if this is good or bad, but I'm just gonna try it. I can murder almost anyone I come across now. There are very few individuals who can withstand my punch. Watch. Again, I don't know how I keep getting promoted and or demoted. It's like there's no real rhyme or reason. I am a guardian class hero. I don't know if that's the right way to describe what I do to people. I'm more like a threat than a hero. From the top rope! Ugh. 
My friends are now all glowing unicorn dragons. I love that when I run, I vomit out like four leaf clovers. It's as if though I'm lucky, I'm a mighty class hero. I am not lucky. You do not want to be near me when I swing my fists. This happens. Mm. This is insane. All my power, and this is how tough the worlds are at this point. I am just barely punching through these walls. Five hundredth stage glowing death horny helmets with spider legs. I don't even know what these are. Oh my god, I found my hometown. It's New Jersey. I love how there's just toxic waste everywhere. Don't mind me, I'm just bathing in death over here. I drink radiation for breakfast. What comes after first class hero? Elite class hero. I feel like we're just making up adjectives now. I don't skip leg day so much that there is fire vomiting itself out of my calves. All right, still not in Australia. I have to get rid of the pets because they're getting so big, you can't see. Wow. My punches now break time and space. Look at it. It just clears out entire areas. Look at the damage! This planet is looking at me wrong. Oh my god. I think we may have- we're not done yet, but I am at the point where this stupidity knows no bounds! Look at all the orbs! This is the soul of all the planets that I have eviscerated. Can I destroy this entire map before it regenerates? Oh, no way. I can. That's the whole map. We don't need normal numbers. Where we're going. Oh, my pets are now flying potatoes. That's cool. Well, this is a very, very flashy board here. Yeah, there's a lot of crystals and stuff. Die! Look at how small my punches are right now. Look at how weak. Look at how frail. This is just temporary, you understand, because every time I gain even a little bit of power, it is multiplied so many times over. Legendary class hero. When I punch, it now sounds like a cannon going off. Look at it. This board used to give me trouble. Not anymore. Oh, there's the grand crystal. Oh! I can now evaporate this entire board in one punch. One single punch, and the board evaporates. Behold, my beautiful D&D &D ice cube dragon devil friends. <laughs> Back to doing barely any damage for the moment. Oh, I got yeeted into space. This is what space looks like. Also, I'm on fire. Oh, the power is starting to rise. Oh, the power is starting to rise! Rank up! Okay, I'm starting to destroy large swaths of the planet again. When I punch, there's now black holes that come out of my hands. Where's your crystal of power? I know it's around here somewhere. Oh. Oh, there it is! Oh, yeah! Now I can destroy this entire planet in one punch. I don't actually know what I'm looking at anymore. I have made it to Australia. All right, how strong are the walls of Australia? Oh, oh my God. I love how Australia is just a water-based planet. Oh, the power crystal. Here it is. Come here. Uh, 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 oh, <laughs> no. I am now the strongest, literally the strongest, the strongest. That means there's only one thing left to do, and that is murder everyone I see. There can be only one. Urgh! I'm the strongest, worst person, and I've killed everyone else here. That means the only place that'll accept me now is space. Hey anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Strongest Punch Simulator. Until next time, stay foxy and much love. All right, we're checking out the only game where you can run so fast that you can run away from the guilt for all the money you're about to spend. It's Race Clicker. Race Clicker is a game where you have to tap on the screen in order to power up your calf muscles so that you can run incredibly fast. Now, if you look around, you can see people with top speeds such as 635,000 miles per hour. Rookie numbers! Now, as you can see in the beginning here, 
we're starting going only 162 miles an hour. But there's a way to make this much more stupid. With the power of money. Now, while our Florida man continues to run toward his inevitable death, we'll do things such as buy an auto clicker. I love that it, the whole game is about running and you can just, <laughs> you can just completely ignore that and go straight into a car. You know what? Sure. I'm not gonna lie, the car does look kind of sick. As we move over to the shop here, there's things such as Super Luckies or yeah. anime runs. What What's the point of an anime run if you're driving inside the car? Yeah, let's, let's just go ahead and grab all this and uh, let's just start with some acceleration. Now you can see here in the end before we died randomly, we got 14 wins. That's terrible. Boosts. Are these boosts multiplicative? Like, can I can I get both of these for 15 minutes and then suddenly it's times six instead of times two and times three? I feel like everything inside of Roblox is simply multiplicative. Oh, hold on, I need to I need to start clicking. Go. Oh my God! I love that it just begins spastically clicking all over the screen. There's no rhyme or reason to the area and or direction that it clicks in. Wow. All right, 900 miles an hour. Not bad. I love that when you compare everything though, if you look at the bottom here, look at how fast some of the people in this game already are. There's like a cat inside of a box or something running at 200,000 miles an hour. All right, yeah, so let's go ahead and put this on there. We got times two wins. I'm really hoping that this stacks because that would be amazing. I want numbers that make absolutely no sense. Oh, it absolutely stacks. You know, I'm gonna buy the double acceleration too. If we're gonna go all the way with stupidity and get numbers that shouldn't even be reasonable for human beings, we might as well go all the way. As you can see, sad Florida man is actually reaching the area of the teal. We're getting lapped like a million times, but listen, we just started, all right? We're also getting a hundred wins per, per flag now. Okay. So now, the highest score we've gotten is 931. I love that you can buy a skateboard, which is worse than this car that you start with. Uh, yeah, I think that the numbers in this game are gonna start getting completely unrealistic because we started at 100 and something, went to 900 and something, now we're getting ready to pass 3,000. Okay, so how fast is is 3,000? Okay, I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty fast. It's getting so fast to the point that I almost can't control it. What else can you combine? Times two clicks? Really? I have no idea what kind of like weird brontosaurus eggs we're gonna be chowing down on, but I might as well buy these. Pets. What happens if you go backwards? Can you go backwards? You can go backwards? Whoa! <laughs> Open. Okay. Dominus egg. Sure. Oh my god. Plus 16k speed. Oh boy. Oh my god. I'm already at 20,000. Oh why? 23,000, 24,000, 27,000. All right, well, uh, we're at the point now where we're not gonna be last anymore. Oh my god. I love how you can just Tokyo drift your way to the end. Like, I'm not even, I'm not even remotely driving this. Yes! <laughs> Now on the plus side, we have made it to the yellow brick road. I am starting to run directly into the sun. I am now running on a sea of blood. The sea of blood is actually very, very long. It's like one giant fruit roll up. Okay, so this is the final, the final longest road here is this purple one. So is this leveling this being? Is that what's happening here? Yep. Uh, yeah, so we're at 62,000 now. I feel like I'm getting to the point where I can probably buy a better car. So you'll notice that we've only started becoming stupid, and we're already getting to the point where we're passing most of the pack, but we're not in first place every single time. So we can't stop until that happens. At this point, I've just decided to buy all the luck too, because why not? All right, now that we're just stacked with the tattoos of winning, I can try and get some pets. All right, what pets am I allowed to have? 200,000 wins, I'm almost there. What are these? Yeah, sure, open three. I got three disco balls. All right, over the pets. Uh, yeah, whatever, craft them all. Equip the best ones. So yeah, I'm over 105,000 now. Oh, wow, what, what just happened? I think I went so fast that my car decided to puncture a hole in the side of reality or something. I love how you, you get to the point where you go through everything so quickly that the game just starts vomiting winds out at you. Like, watch what happens here when we lap ourselves. Boo! <laughs> it just winds everywhere. When we get done here, I have something of an idea. 
It's a costly idea, but we might as well do it. Wait, you can choose your color of this? Oh my god. Why didn't you tell me? Oh, that's hot. Now we're talking. There is no way that a Florida man driving a hot pink car going at, you know, the speed of light. While a job, I don't even know what this is supposed to be. Looks like Slender Man's nephew made out of gold is in the passenger seat. What happens if you just have like a stack of these? Two, one, and we have to beat 105,000. I get, I get the sinking feeling that this isn't going to be that difficult, considering we've already passed 105,000. Wait, you can, you can fit more than three creatures inside of your vehicle? Well, wait a second. What happens if you just keep on stacking the creatures? Like, where do they go? How do you get enough space? Hold on, I have an idea. Okay, so it looks like you can go up to five. Okay, so we have 653,000 wins now. What? Oh, I get a free spin. Sure. More acceleration, eh? Just gonna keep buying more and more of these creatures. There's a certain amount of illegality going on inside of my car because there's just two random creatures chilling out inside of my trunk. Oh, also, we're over 210,000 now. I just got a snow bunny. I have no idea what this is doing, but I have a feeling it's going to increase my speed by stupid- Oh my god! Yeah, just don't ask. It's better that way. Yep. That's the thing that's happening now. We are going past a million miles an hour. Each click I have is now worth 125 extra speed. We are now almost in the area of 1 million. So I turned lobby speed on. That is a terrible, terrible idea. Oh my God. You can't do anything. Okay, so what we have to do now is keep rebirthing, which sounds awful. It's like effectively I have to just go through childhood over and over again, but it keeps stacking acceleration and win percentage to absolutely stupid amounts. And we need a lot of acceleration because my speed is over a million. Next rebirth in three, two, one, now. I love that I don't even exist on this, on this color scheme anymore. Look at how quickly I pass everyone now. It is... It's relatively insane. All right, well, we're doing another rebirth here. So acceleration plus 89, and now... Oh my God, it goes up to 105. If you look at the insanity of the numbers on the screen, every once in a while, I'm getting like 4,000 wins per lap. I've got 31 laps at this point. 33, 35. I literally went off of the... Oh my God. <laughs> I was gonna say, I blasted my way straight off of the entire map. Like the Phoenix, I crash and burn and it hurts a lot. But then eventually, I am reborn. I have just broken the sound barrier. It was a sound barrier made of color and, and insanity. It's totally possible that I've simply just portaled into another dimension. There it is, out of the way. You can't even see my character just about anymore down here because I accelerate through all of the different laps so quickly. I have rebirthed 12 times. I'm up to 179% acceleration and almost 500 times the wins. I have moved into space. Yes, for some reason, I am now driving my vehicle in space. A lot of planets in here. I don't actually get to see any of them because I'm moving so fast. Like if you, if you don't blink in just like a moment's glance, you can possibly see I, that may have been a galaxy. I'm not really sure. It may also be an asteroid that's moving at me or trying to murder me. Each time I win on like the big back end of the 100K win, I'm getting something like 86K thousand flags. Ocean, sure. Okay, so now it's times five. Oh, I guess I could just keep going. Yeah, let's let's just, let's just, so what's the candy world? Times seven. <laughs> Hold on, there's, we're really just kind of, oh my, <laughs> I'm in the other world times 50, yeet it! Okay, so this is, uh, this is what Satan's backyard looks like, huh? I think I may have seen a bat. There was definitely a pitchfork. Oh, also, I'm in third place now. Hey, this is the type of instance 
where the devil looks over at like his little imp sidekicks and he's like, Hey, did you see what just sideswiped my car? And the little imp is like, Say, you ain't got no car no more. The speed at which Gray is moving is fracturing the cosmos. I'm now almost getting a million flags per lap. Look at that. But that's still rookie numbers. I'm not really sure where else you can go here. A pirate, okay. 27, <laughs> okay. Oh, I've gotta, I've gotta do more here in order to- 15 rebirths, you got it. Oh, I am in second now, but I can't stop until I'm the fastest in the universe. More rebirths. We're moving on to the castle port. Times 54. Gonna go on 17 rebirths now. We need 18 to get to the next level. Into the next portal. The robot world. Oh my god, 144 die. I can see the power of AI very, very briefly. Imagine running into like a Tron entity at this speed. It would just vaporize both of us. I can make over a billion flags now. Rebirth. I love how the clouds in the background is kind of like a sad watercolor painting. I feel like I made this sometime in eighth grade. Okay, so at this point, we've got up to 1.16 million speed, but that's still not enough. We need to win every single time. So we're gonna come over here to the trait vendor and we're gonna go ahead and roll a trait. And what we're looking for is the multiplicativity of the clicks. So we want clicks in order to get this speed even stupider. Oh, it's right there. Big money, big money. 10%, okay, that's something. They may see right now, my pet has also evolved into an angry robotic egg. Like an egg that's sad that you've eaten so much protein in your life, so he's gonna murder you and your family. Okay, 11% clicks. I also love that one of the pets is called Ecstatic Robot. It's only because he doesn't know who he's belonging to. Once he finds out that Gray still plays as his owner, he's gonna go to Depressed no! Robot. Yeah, in case you're wondering what your job is, Ecstatic Robot, it's to basically get eaten by other robots and become larger robot uh, now, a robot all by itself is sad, so we need to get this guy more traits. Basically, through the power of math, we're going to make numbers absolutely stupid. Okay, another 11% clicks. Okay, so now the question is, does, does everyone have a trait? Yes, 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 yes. Terrible trait. Okay. Now, finally, everyone has more clicks. Also, I have to mention something. We're gonna have to come in first because right now, first is just a mass of hair. That's right, though. Florida Man is on the case with his quartet of very angry robots chilling out in the back seat. I love how no one wants to ride shotgun, and then you have this elf over here that's like, God, I've been abducted by four psychopaths. Now, notice how some folks are just running to victory. Look at him, trying so hard going as fast as he can. Little does he know the agony that awaits him. Although to be fair, this random dude over here with the devil on his shoulder has a rocket launcher like in his mouth. Look at it. It is in his head. That's not his head either. That is part of this vehicle. The time has come to see just how much speed we can build up. Are you ready? Oh my God. <laughs> 208. 1.24, 1 1.25, 1.3. Keep going. Don't give up. 1.34. We're going for 1.4 million speed. Okay. 1.3821. Go. Yeet it. <laughs> now you can see at the moment, Taylor Swift right now is in third. But don't you worry. This is just the beginning of the stupidity that's to come. Right, what do we need to our next rebirth? Two billion wins. I love that I'm just interdimensionally traveling from world to world at this point, just due to the speed. We're way past light speed at this point. But now we can go into the forest realm where the times for clicking is 288. <laughs> that right there is a lot of clicking going on. Okay, we now have a new high score of 1.42 million. I think there may be a palm tree, I'm not really sure. Because the second I see a tree, it evaporates from the sheer speed that we're running into it. 
Like you can't even you can't even contact your insurance company because I'm not sure that our insurance company is in the same dimension that we're currently in. Next round is the circus portal. At 23 rebirths, you got it. At this point, the wins are coming in so fast. Look at it. That buying additional rebirths is no big deal. So we're gonna make it onto the next board now where the clicks keep doubling. It's just gonna get exponentially stupid. All right, we need 2.5 billion wins for the next rebirth, which we're gonna have in about five seconds. And there it is. Let's go ahead and do it. Three billion now. Okay, so this means that we can move over to the circus world. This is like my backyard here. This is fantastic. 720. Oh my god. You can see some of the Ferris wheels. Pretty sure there was a bowling pin in there. Got a cloud that looks vaguely like a clump of dusty mashed potatoes. But the big point in all this is that each time you get the wins now, you're getting up to a million wins. It's a brand new record. 1.47 million speed. We need 5 billion wins for the last rebirth that I want to get. I can picture the Marvel Universe trying to fight Thanos and then they're losing and all of a sudden a Florida man in a pink car with a bunch of robots and one jolly elf just plows him over and it turns into a fine mist. A Thanos mist, if you will. Well, here's the rebirth. Not like it matters, because if you look, every time we pass, we get like 50 million. Look at this. <laughs> From 40 to 85. <laughs> the time has finally come to go nuclear. 1,440 times. Come on. <laughs> Plus 16% clicks now. We are being irradiated, but it's fine. If there's one thing I love drinking early in the morning, it's plutonium. It's the breakfast of winners, okay? The time has finally come to get into first place. Let's see where the numbers get at this point. Okay, 132, 135, 137, 140. Oh boy, I think we're gonna get up to 1.5 million. Oh yeah, 1.5, 1.52. <laughs> 1.53! Also, I have to mention, this dude over here has a controller attached to his back that's actually kind of amazing. I wanted to go even further than 1.54 million before we go into first place, so I've picked it up another notch. You'll see here in a minute. All right, I've had my uranium bath, so in 27 seconds, we're gonna click like madmen. Now, this person over here also has a similar pinkish car. That does concern me. We got 155. And that means that after all that. Oh, yeah, we are now the fastest being in the universe. We have a winner. Well, I'm going to go ahead and murder rainbows thanks to my pure speed. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Race Clicker. Until the next time, stay foxy and much love. All right, we're checking out the only game where the entire reason to work out is to punch people into a fine paste. It's weightlifting simulator. I have never in my life seen Florida man more hideous. I'm allergic to calories right now. You can see my knees are so scrawny. They have grown two additional knees out of them. But don't worry, with the power of science and money, we will become the strongest person in the universe solely so that we can punch people into the stratosphere and murder them. Not gonna lie, I wish I wish that all of my work led to something productive. It doesn't. Bench press. I'm so concerned. I feel like this is unsafe. <coughs> Hold on, I can give you a first person perspective of how unsafe this feels. <laughs> now obviously you could sit here clicking your entire life away as you slowly get stronger. I really hope that my shorts are going to grow with me, otherwise Florida man is, <laughs> his pelvis is just gonna explode out of his pants. Or you could spend a bunch of money. Times two speed, please. Times two strength. I have a question. Is the times two strength and the times four strength multiplicative? Let us find out. All right, so if we go back to the bench press, 
Uh, five strength. I really don't know. Oh, wow. Okay, so it says like two strength. It is not giving you two strength. It is giving you a lot more strength than that. 166 to 19. Oh, I'm sorry, 226. I love it. None of it makes any sense. I st I'm still, i still not looking very good. I don't even have fingers at all. Also, the dollar store Goku is just chilling out over my left shoulder. It's really concerning. It was a secondary Goku or his hair's on fire. Oh, we're gonna go crazy. I want numbers that shouldn't even exist. All right, let's see what happens. Back over to the bench press. Start doing this. 226, two, two, oh my God, 289. What is this? What is this? What is this being next to me? The true Shadow Lord won. Oh, he's a stick figure. I mean, so am I. 353 strength. I still haven't gained a single muscle. In fact, I'm pretty sure that my own shoulders are stabbing me in the throat. It's okay, though. Still more things that we can do here. Akimbo, wait. What? Let you rep twice as fast. Ooh! That's right. Some people dual wield guns. I dual wield weights and protein shakes. You know what, let's just go all the way. What is the purpose of a bigger size flashlight for? I'm not gonna lie, I never knew that required, like, like, like a flashlight was required for fitness. All right, now usually there's things like, oh yeah, speedy bars, protein shakes, gems, oh my God. Oh, I can have Satan as a best friend, that's nice. Yeah, we are 100% gonna be the strongest human beings here. Ugh. Ugh. What is this? What? 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 Whoa! Whoa! What? What? What am I? What am I lifting? What? What was that? I'm like doing this. I'm like sitting up while triple wielding weights. I love it. Stats, buffness. 0.15. I don't even have a single a single bit of buffness to me. Wonderful. I have to run on this treadmill because my speed is so slow. I feel like I'm, I'm going to just use my own kneecap and stab myself in the throat with it. At first I thought I was sweating so hard that the sweat was vomiting out of my pores, but it's just little energy symbols. I didn't know that you could do tandem running. Hold on, can I run with you? Oh, I can run in front of you. I just scared that individual so much they had to leave. I don't know if you can see it. I'm lifting weights right now. Can you see the weight? <laughs> Realistically, I'm just lifting like a malformed paper clip. Okay, I got the muscular award. I don't- I do not feel muscular. In case you're wondering what I'm doing, this is like full contact dabbing. What in the- what is this? Oh my god! <laughs> Can I become this big? I need to know. A brawl is starting. I kind of want to know. Welcome to Florida Beach, the boxing ring. A player is chosen every 10 seconds to fight to the death. I've been chosen. Who am I up against? Oh, I think I actually have a, a chance here. This is kind of a tiny person. Ow. <laughs> just you wait. I just got dabbed so hard that my head got caved in. I'm not happy about this. This looks so unreasonable. Okay, so obviously what we could do is do this the hard way or... So what happens if you just buy like a ridiculous pet? Max 150% strength, my God. A few hours later. So here's the plan. One, we need to get enough rebirths to go to all of these different places and find out exactly what happens. Two, I need to become king of the hill. And three, I have to murder everyone in the brawl. Who is the strongest? 6.7 million strength, eh? You got it. You can see here's my crowned curse. I was punching the dollar store cyborg over here. It's kind of like Voltron, if Voltron had really bad credit score. Now you can see at the moment, you can go up to him and you can hit him and it'll tell you how much damage you do. Ready? Ooh. Zero. Zero damage. Oh, the, very, the other thing I have to do, I'm gonna remember that. I'm gonna remember that win, jit. The other thing I have to do is rename my pet. Crowned Curse? No, no. Your new name is Cheetus, the Mighty. All right, so how good is how good is having Cheetus here with us? Oh my God. Um, <laughs> oh no. Oh, hold on, I don't want to do the brawl quite yet. So in like three seconds, we had, what is it? Like 85,000 strength. Hold on. Oh, it can't even catch up fast enough. It, it shows 173, but it says our strength is 255,000. Uh, I need to check something real quick. Hey, remember that time when you punched me? It made me very sad. Yeah, that's what happens, man. I got murdered by, by the creature, but I'll totally take that death. Did it say it could absorb his soul? What? Uh, I need to test something real quick. Here, don't, let me just let me just borrow you for just one quick second. There we are. There's too much stuff in the way. There's all these fortune chances. 
I could have a shake that's called like an ice shake. It's like a discount shake. There's really no- how about you? I murdered another person, but his soul is not something I can eat right now. There, how about you, house lifter? This guy's very tough. If you notice, he can take a lot of hits before he dies. Nothing. No soul. Instead, I was just kind of like violently dancing on his body. All right, well, let's start rebirthing a lot. So, um, I'm already at, I don't know how many rebirths this is, like 25 or something. It's plus 120% current strength. I will take the death immediately all the time to get this number to ridiculous heights. Oh my god, 27 rebirths now. So how many do you need for all these different levels? Oh, the tiny zone. I mean, I'm kind of tiny. My strength is less than 500, you know, for like half a second until I lift one single weight. Is this Satan's house? Oh my god, it's called the Underworld Gym. Well, I can do it. I've got, I've got the five the five rebirths, so what happens in here? Oh, Underworld weights give you 2.5 times the stat. Look at the size of the benches. <laughs> How do I even reach this? <laughs> this, okay, real quick, there is a certain level. Oh, you can't. <laughs> the weight gets so small. Man, I, uh, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, at least the equipment's big enough for me. I've got plenty of space here to work out. That's nice. So what do you get for lifting all the, like doing all these bench presses? 14 strength. Well, technically 85,000 strength. The one thing I'll say is I am not fast enough either. The treadmill is the size of an actual city. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just gonna go run inside of this apartment complex real quick. I love that Florida man's looking up at it. He's like, oh my God. What kind of skins can I get? Energy, skulls, disco. Uh, how do I, oh, crates. Yeah, for some reason it did not spend like, I bought the 20 million gems to buy the, the creature, and then it didn't take them from me, so I still have almost 20 million gems. Uh, yeah, give me the legend crate, I guess. Whatever. Sure. What does this do? Oh, here we go. And now I'm going to be... Purple evap, no rings, yay! I love how it lands on rings and it gives me purple evap anyway. <laughs> Alright, so what, what does the purple stuff do? Is it- Oh! I'm lifting a small nuclear warhead now. Nice. Can I, can I like jump on this? Hold on, I think I have a way to grow myself. Say hello to new and improved Florida man. All right, can I get up on this now? Am I tall enough? Am I big, am I tall enough to ride the ride? No, I have to get even bigger. Say hello to even more new and improved Florida man. I love how my chest just looks like a giant pile of mashed potatoes. I wouldn't say I look that strong. I'm. <laughs> I look unhealthy, more like it. Do I have to jump to the front here to actually get any exercise in? When does it register that I'm on it? Oh, there it is. All right, so how much speed does this give you? Oh, 0.1. That was way better than 0 0.04. Oh, yeah. Yeah, give it to me. My buffness is now up to 2.25. I want my buffness to go infinite. I want to get so big that I'm bigger than the entire map. In fact, I'm not stopping until this happens. Can you, can you like work out while you're running or can you only do one or the other? I can only do one or the other. I do appreciate a game that rounds down to like the septicajillionth percent. Do we really need all of this? <laughs> all right, at 14, we're gonna move on and see what the next area that we can go into is with our rebirth amount. And if we don't have it yet, we're gonna get more. All right, 14 speed now. Oh, I also have these different abilities. I mean, I hadn't really messed with them. What does it do? Does it, is it, oh, Ooh, what is this one? What is it, like a Hadouken? Oh, I push up so hard that it blows up the earth beneath me. That is how you work out hardcore. All right, what else we got over here? Why is there like a Viking warship just in the middle of this pool? That doesn't make a lot of sense. All right, there's the desert with one rebirth. No, that's not good enough. Oh, hold on, there's a king of the hill. Uh, hold on, can I do push-ups too? Oh, I have an even stronger workout here. Oh yeah, chest muscles, bam. Bring it on. All right, let's go ahead and turn this off. Let's turn the uh, the protector on. This is how you protect yourself. Excuse me, good sir. Thank you. Oh, I'd like your soul too. Ah, uh, tastes like strawberry jam. I love it. I had to become the king of the hill real quick, like just to do it. Are you coming back over here to attack me? It looks like you are. Do you have an infin- Do you have like a invulnerability spear on? Get out of here. I'm the king of the hill, the strongest. The most powerful. My head is the tiniest, all right? My head is like 180th the size of my whole body. You know how babies have oversized heads? My head forgot to grow up. I think I've murdered enough people in the King of the Hill right now. What else we got over here? Sky Gym. 
three rebirths. That's still not enough. Oh, the big boy beach. I am indeed a big boy. 2,000 strength. No problem. I am just the slowest, like, lumbering being in the entire universe. Oh, there's more rebirth places over here in Big Boy Beach. I got really concerned, so I took out my flashlight. I paid for it after all. I might as well use it. Okay, so there's like one portal way out here in the corner. How many rebirths does it take? Not gonna lie, Big Boy Beach looks a lot like Florida. 75 rebirths. We are absolutely doing this. Oh yeah, I the tiger. Oh God, it restarts you back to the tiny size. <laughs> That's okay though, because like I said, we're gonna get the biggest size eventually anyway. So this is okay. This brings me back to my childhood. All right, back in the day, before I had biceps the size of like air buses. All right, yeah, keep rebirthing. All right, we're at 30 so far. I love how I'm gaining strength while I'm dead. Like, I'm in the active process of melting into the pavement, and the game is like, you know what? You're getting stronger. Really? Am I? I don't really feel like it. I feel like I'm dying. I'm buying the VIP pass. I don't know what it does, but I want it. I had to go back to working out this way because I love the fact that it looks like I'm lifting an entire galaxy in my hands. Also, it's really concerning if I look at myself from the side because like my forearm and my bicep just look like two Vienna sausages that are connected together like poorly. All right, keep it going. We're at 36. I'm up to 44 rebirths. Okay, I'm up to 48 rebirths and my current strength multiplier is 240%. I have died countless times so far of my own volition, but kind of like a, like a discount Super Saiyan. I get slightly stronger each time. No joke, I've got over 50 rebirths now. I've gone to, I've gone to heaven. Oh, never mind, I'm back. While I'm doing this, getting just a ridiculous amount of percentages to my strength and rebirths, I figure I could take a spin since it's free. Fortune wheel. Sure. Spin number one. Go! Oh wow, this will give you a, almost made me vomit. Oh, it's a speedy bar. This looks like chocolate. I feel like it's a lie. All right, spin number two, a protein bar. I'm just getting all the bars, all the calories I'm losing by working out like 400 hours a day. I'm just, I'm losing it all to this fortune wheel. I've got nothing but bars. I got only bars all the whole time. Okay, this is the very last rebirth. Once I get this one, we can go over to wherever the- I've been rebirthing so many times. Like, if you- if, if each time you rebirth, they make a copy of your brain. Like, the copy of the copy has gotten so distorted now that I don't even forgot- I can't remember where I'm going. All right, here we go. All right, over to Big Boy Beach. I need to beat, like, 5.8 million strength, so we'll go for, like, 6 million and see how tall that gets us. Like how the gyms went from one rebirth to three to five to 75. Oh, this gym is in Michigan, that's nice. Yeah, let's do it. Oh yeah, I get to work out with hypothermia. All right, so how, how much does these treadmills give you when you run on them? Oh wow, 0. 0.12. Okay, so how about bench pressing, like whatever element this is, it's like basically a bar made out of solid neutrons. Radioactive bar. Go! 844 just for using the bar. Oh my god. I love it. I'm squatting basically like two buses connected by a by like a light pole. Okay, this does all right, but I have a better idea. I need to rebirth one more time. Just trust me on this. Okay, so now we're gonna gain some strength. Now, as weird as it sounds, I need to die to unlock my true potential. Yeah, I'll do a brawl, why not? Can I just, can I just keep exercising while I'm waiting? I guess I'll just keep exercising while I'm waiting. All right, you know what to do. <laughs> Neither of us are attacking each other. We're just sitting in here working out. <laughs> hey, you got a job to do. <laughs> or I guess you can just die. <laughs> oh, I absorbed his soul, here we go. I have no idea why. But if you transfer from the different exercises, like back and forth while you're working out, you gain a lot faster strength. This is so weird. You can actually transfer between all your different abilities while you're working out and get everything at once. Like I'm sitting, I'm working out, I'm blowing things up. Stuff is blowing up when I'm not even in the process of doing the attack. <laughs> Look at it. Oh yeah. Oh, this is happening. 2.3 million. Oh, it's going up ridiculously fast. There's some random guy trying to step on me, like some huge dude, and he can't do it because I keep blowing him away. 
I don't know where he went. I don't know if you saw his time his gigantic foot trying to crush me and then he died. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and start the brawl. Why not? What's up? I have a feeling I'm the strongest, but there's still much more exercise I need to do. I literally have a Super Saiyan aura now. I have a Super Saiyan. I have 3.2 million strength. I'm halfway to my goal, but there's someone who stands in the way, and that is... What is your name? Destiny. <laughs> it is Destiny. Whoop, whoop, it's, it's like 2 million damage. I've got something of a problem. Uh, I think I need to die to unlock even more things. The problem is I don't know if anyone can kill me. Like, I can just go over here, and I can stomp everyone away. King of the Hill is contested. Uh, okay, if you say so. But was contested. <laughs> He's only doing like a thousand damage, and I have 42,000 hit points. Oh, hold on, we have another winner over here. How much damage do you do? 10 damage. Okay. <laughs> Oh, that seems incredibly unfair. <laughs> That's it, keep hacking away, you can do it. Come on. I think I'm actually out healing her damage. I am. I'm out healing this girl's damage. She she actually cannot kill me. I feel terrible. Your headphones are fantastic, by the way. All right, well. Hadouken! <laughs> Here we go. While I'm working out, notice how every once in a while the tornado of death occurs from my body. People can't even get close to the King of the Hill area right now because it's just a non-stop, like, Category 5 hurricane. <laughs> I've given up being, like, non-stop the King of the Hill at this point, so we're having, like, a little dance party over here. This girl's head banging. Like, oh, never mind, that dude next to her just murdered her. <laughs> well, how could you do this? Wow, he's just killing everyone around me. Thanks, buddy. He's making my job really easy. I get to remain King of the Hill, and <laughs> anyone who gets close, he just keeps killing them. Okay. So we're almost at six million, and then we're gonna go as big as we can. What is this? Is he- Is this betrayal? You betrayed me? All right. Where'd he go? <laughs> he left. I can't even get my- I can't even get my retribution because he fled. Okay. Six million strength. 6.1 million. Because why not? You can see this is, uh... This is how big I am at the moment. Now, right now, I'm the size of the elemental cyborg. Also, my head has completely, like, fallen into my body. I love it. My neck muscles have swallowed my entire skull. That's fantastic. But we're, we can go bigger. We're not done yet. Okay, so at this point now, we have we have basically left the board in size. Like, I'm, I'm almost... You know what? Hold on. I need to get into the clouds. When I die, when someone finally hits me and I fall, my entire body... Like, my body is as long as the board. Can I even hit people like this? I have no idea what I'm targeting. Look at my size now. I can't zoom out anymore. This is as far as I'm allowed to zoom out. I am I am drinking the clouds. I'm, I'm falling. Hold on. Timber! <laughs> Almost falling into the other, into the other boards. That wasn't the max height. I'm actually even bigger. This is it. This is the maximum size. <laughs> so when you're this big, what happens when you use your special ability? Oh, you jump into space. Well, I literally just left the entire board. I went into space. Look. Well, there you go. I completely disappeared from the entire game. I got so strong. I can't reality can't hold me anymore <laughs> Hey folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of weightlifting sim 3 until next time. Stay foxy. Much love All right, we're checking out the only game where you can make infinite money by destroying your own life. It's broken bones 4 See that landing straight on the skull Maybe cartwheeling a couple times. Getting a concussion. 12 bones broken. Rookie numbers! Now, one of the things that you can do is increase some of the abilities. Helium balloon, you got it. I love that you can increase, like, basically everything, including brakes, sprains, dislocations, flight control, <laughs> jump height, bounce level. What if you just buy all this to the max? We're maxing out every single thing here. I don't care what it takes. I want to know what really happens when you max this. Infinite brakes? Why would you want anything else? Mm, infinite regret? That sounds good. Even the skeleton's over here. He's like, do it, great. Maximum level of all perks from three to five. Yep. Double the gravity. I want ten times the gravity. Wait, you can have five times the gravity? Does that, does that, 
Does that multiply with the two times the gravity? Do I get 10 times the gravity? I am almost sure this makes it times 10 gravity. Oh God! Whoa! Oh God! I'm kind of sliding down the hill too. I love how my character just like gets dragged by the core of the earth down the hill. Oh, I gained level two, you don't say. Mm. 144 bones broken, huh? I feel like this is one of those instances where I immediately need to buy more jumping power. Uh, yeah. Jump height. A lot. Yeah, jump height. One, two. Yeah, however many I could put in there. G give me all the jumps. And a couple of bounces, too. All right, helium balloon. Shift key. You got it. Ow! Oh, my head is up into my armpit. That's nice. Change map, huh? How many map? Oh! Oh! Five million for map 10. I mean, if you say so. The helium balloon is kind of pointless because right now we just don't have the ability to jump high enough to even use it. <laughs> like I'm using the helium balloon, but it doesn't really matter. I love how we're all drowning here at the bottom of the lake. Okay, so we got a brand new sprains record. That's great. Apparently they're all in my wrist and my leg, both on the left-hand side, which is annoying because I'm a lefty. Uh, Yeah, what's the next board look like? Oh, it starts you higher each time. Winter Horror Land. Absolutely going to Winter Horror Land. I love terror out. Now, if only I could just barely, there we go. I was gonna say, if only I could just barely slide off the side of that mountain. I got 283 miles per hour of falling. New break record because I broke 443 pounds. <laughs> oh my God. Why do I feel like this is a game where you gain money unreasonably fast? So what happens if I put a lot into this and this? Like, does it give you a lot more sprains or an average amount more sprains and breaks? Well, it feels like my body's breaking a lot more. Hey there, buddy. Oh, I got a new dislocation record. Okay, this is pretty good, but we need to go way beyond this. These numbers are still rookie numbers. I, the, the screen is so many different colors right now. Wow, I'm, I'm moving through the entire spectrum of colors. I think I see what bees see. One million dollars for that break. A million. I uh, guess I'll change the map. Where's the horror land at? What is it to start? One million? Oh, 1.5 million we can get to, sure. Well, this looks safe. Uh-huh. Oh, oh, oh yeah. I'll make it happen. Oh, hold on. I'm still, I'm slowly dragging my way down the hill to get a couple more bones broken in. I want to get at least a million again. Where's like the steepest part of this mountain? I think it's this side over here. Oh yeah. That's what I love. Uh-huh. Yep. There we go. Shoot the ladder. Perfect. Yeah. Yep. 1.2 million. 671 bones. That's still only three numbers though. Run speed. Sure. What does run speed level 19 get you? Oh, my ankle. Oh, my other ankle. I think I'm literally gonna put everything into bounces right now. Uh, maybe slides. We don't need friction. Where we're going. Ugh. I think I doubled up on concussions right there. I got the two for one sale on concussions. Why do I feel like this is gonna be a brand new record? Whoa. Okay, 970 bones. Almost getting to that four spot. I wanna see what happens if I jump like from the edge over here. If this is kind of a better place to leave the ground. Now, all I did was just kind of ski on my mouth. Firework, dart, uh, okay, go. Firework, oh my God, what? Where does it even send you to? Don't mind me, I'm just head banging very, very violently. See my neck shattering repeatedly? Enough to break over a thousand bones? All right, how far can we get through the map now? 150 million, so we can get to this point. Oh, I just, someone in front of, someone in front of me named Criminal just jumped. Don't you worry, Criminal. You won't be alone. Oh, I need to bounce off of the right side, I think. I did reach a brand new speed limit of 365 miles an hour. I'm going to be breaking bones like at Mach 1. Jump height. Over toward the side. Okay, so I need more sliding abilities to get down through this. Oh yeah. Oh God. All right, I'm almost getting a thousand bones each jump now. What about over here? Is over here like the better area to jump from? I can kind of climb this a little bit. Uh-huh, okay. You get, you get stuck on the ledge. I'm already at like level 11 in ruining my own life. That's not too bad. Oh, I broke every single bone. I got a bonus. It's like coming to work and doing a very thorough job. 
of destroying yourself. So going through all this, oh my god, oh yeah. All right, that, that did, that was surprisingly good. <laughs> was that 916 bones broken there? Flight control. Today's a very important day. I finally got brain damage. All right, I'm, I've got a brand new technique here and this, this technique is working out fantastic. Look at this. Oh, uh, we're getting almost the full slide into the freezing cold super death water. Oh, I didn't break my skull as much as I had hoped. You gotta come all the way over to the side. And then with our ability to control our own destiny. And by control our own destiny, I mean break a lot. If you can kind of ricochet forward off of this this rock over here, you just kind of keep floating. Do it! Okay. Yeah, that's that's not bad. Okay. There, there we go, there we go. Yeah, drag it down and get over to the right. Come on, baby. Just wiggle your pelvis. Fantastic. Good. Yeah, this is happening. This is happening right now. Oh no, my head has gone into the actual planet. It is now slowly being sucked into- God, hemorrhaged. It is now slowly being sucked into the core of the earth. I am now up one level higher. I can't even see where I'm supposed to be falling. I'm basically just falling and hoping that I'm kind of falling in the correct direction. I'm ping-ponging around a lot here. Yeah, keep keep going. Keep going. Just slide. Come on, you're on you're on snow and ice. I know that the that the gravity level is like times 10, but you can still give it your best shot. Level-wise, our our bone breaking level is uh is going up relatively quickly over here. Again, I'm using the balloon, but I don't think it does anything because it can't stand the entirety of this level of gravity. I've maxed out my helium balloon. I don't know what it means to just like shove more helium into it or what? Uh, I, I don't know. I don't feel any better. I don't feel like it's working any better. Oh God, oh yeah. Oh, this is happening. Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay, so now I just kind of get stuck in this pocket. All right, I need to see something because I, I want to know if this is real. Does this really say infinite money? Like actual infinite cash. Oh my god, it does. Uh, okay, we need to try some stuff. So first off, yeah, we're going there. Second off, I want to know what happens when we bring the bounce level to absolutely stupid, like all the way maxed out. Auto clicker. Go! Oh, fantastic. Level 300 bounce. I'm in the lava. I'm literally jumping from a pool of lava. Okay. Oh, here we go. Ow. I, oh, I am actually bouncing now. I wasn't sure through the gravity. Oh, God. I wasn't sure if I'd be able to bounce with this level of gravity, but you absolutely can. I need more sliding abilities, though. Oh, my God. 2,000 bones. Okay, so now the sliding level all the way maxed out. All right, now that I've drowned my body in Crisco, let's see how well. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, sliding. Sliding all right so far. Already got uh, 1,700 bones. Uh, 2,000, 2,300. There's another concussion. Oh, wow. I am actually sliding past the gravity. Three. I have no idea where I'm falling right now. 4,500, 4,800, 5,058, oh my god, 54, 56, 56, yeah, just keep sliding, why not, 63, 64, okay, finally, oh, I'm sliding into the wall, oh, never mind, I am now sliding down to Australia, this is interesting, so, wait a second, what, what is going on right here, that was absolutely horrifying, okay, let's max out the brakes now, brakes level, 300. Go! Okay. 27,000 broken bones! 56,000! 174, 185. I am just. What is going on? What happened there? 301,000! Oh, I'm the highest level! Hold on, I gotta I gotta try something. Since we have the ability to like use all these different things here, gravitate, smack down. Okay. So if you do it the first time. I'm gonna save some of this. I'm gonna see how far we can like bounce and break and everything. 213,000, okay. I'm gonna use it now. Ah! <laughs> you almost go off the board. Use the dart. No idea what the dart is doing. Again, I, I like my character is violently trying to just leave the board. I'm gonna use sprung. That looks absolutely slender man Oh my God. Smack down. Okay, bit way up. 
Okay, that drags you. Oh, <laughs> we're still falling because why not? 670,000 bones. Whatever gravitate is. Yeah, let's start us back at the top over here. Oh, is this just. Is that turning the gravity inside out? Was that, what, is that what that was supposed to be? There's a time flip. Obliterate. Is there something called like osmosis? Oh, it's mitosis. I'm still falling. We're going to get a million bones broken. It's a million. We have now bro broken a million bones at this point. There's nothing else I could do right now, but that's all right. Yep. That is my groin. That is my groin folding in half. 1.1 million bones. Broke every bone. You don't say. Yeah, I would say that's a new breaks record. Oh, we already went to level 100. <laughs> uh, I kind of want to increase these perk cooldowns to use them like way more. There we go. Okay, so now we have time flip, revert, and mitosis. So I guess we'll see what those do. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Feels good. Still alive. No concussion either. So you get to see everything. You get to see my body spiraling towards sadness. All right, time flip. What, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, it like brings you back to where you were a couple of moments ago. All right. How about revert? Also kind of brings you back maybe? Man, the speed is getting to be ridiculous. Where, where even are we? And uh, yeah, I'm gonna use this too. Oh, it gives you two of yourself. I had no idea that it splits you like an amoeba. <laughs> I got ligmatized. Oh, no, I have ligma. I wonder where the other gray still plays went. Sprains all the way. I'm going to grow new joints just to sprain them. This is my special mutant powers. All I did, like some people are double jointed. I'm like infinitely jointed with the sole purpose of spraining all of my joints. You know what, while we're at it, let's just bring up dislocations too. We might as well go crazy. We have our firework ready. We'll see what that ends up doing because right now we should be, look at this, 5,000 ligaments, 5,000 ligaments, 11,000 bones in like one fall, 14,000, 45,000, whatever. We're uh, at 500,000 bones broken right now. I'm trying to slow down my fall. Like, so I get more time breaking the most amount of bones I can. Oh, yeah. A lot of ligaments. A lot of ligaments that I could have had, but are now gone. Hey there, Mr. Tree. Been a while since I've seen you. I've been too busy having most of my hypothalamus come out of my nose. And we're easily going to get a million bo broken bones again. Yeah, there we go. And if I can get into the water to just cool myself off, that would be fantastic. I love it. Flight control and run speed. All right, we only have two other things to max out from the top of the mountain. Florida man. Look, whoa! <laughs> okay, I vastly underestimated how ridiculously stupid <laughs> the speed boost was. I need to try this one more time. I have no idea what happened to my body. Oh wow, I'm like a I'm like a human frisbee. Look at me spin. Hmm. There we go. Yeah, all of my limbs are like little violent throwing stars. They are just flying everywhere. Special dance maneuver. Getting brain damage is just like a normal day at work. Now just real quick, I have to mention too. There's actually another place that you can. Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa. All right, I'm, I'm like running so fast that I can barely handle how fast I'm running. There's another place that you can jump, which is basically str straight into the bowels of the underworld. Look at how ridiculous this is. It's really good for gaining a lot of speed too, I will say. Uh-huh. Oh yeah, it's kind of like getting flushed down the toilet. I don't know if you get more bones this way. You can definitely fall further. Oh, there's a concussion. There's some brain damage. See, right now we're at about 900,000 bones broken. Yeah, you get about a million there if you do it just right. And I have no idea what this utility thing is even gonna do. I need to get level 200 to find out what obliterate is. All right, jump height all the way. I wonder if it just lets you jump off the board. Cause right now I'm like the flash, but with no self-preservation, like at all. All right, level 200, obliterate. Let's see how good this jump is. Whoa! Oh God! Oh, I have no idea what's happening right now. I'm getting the oof of the gods. I think I'm at the bottom of the mountain. I really don't know. Am I? Oh, nope, hold on. 
There's like, there's like slightly more places to slide into through here. Hold on, I'm time flipping because I, I'd rather fall this way, I think. What just happened to my leg? Oh my god. What is going on with my body? Part of my limb has decided to go across the entire board. Uh. Uh, this is really weird. <laughs> the game isn't stopping. I'm just stuck here, breaking my entire body for- Oh my god! <laughs> Look at it! Look at it though, the game- It's not stopping, normally it stops you, but here it doesn't. I've managed to find infinite pain! In case you're wondering, I just kind of like left it here to see if I really would just be permanently stuck inside the ground. Yep. Wrists are just gyrating. Manically breaking forever. Look at the epic jazz hands off the tree. Nothing but net 600,000 broken bones 700,000 broken bones. Maybe the toilet is better. Oh, I can kind of just slide. What is going on? Look at this Wait a minute. I kind of have an idea. I keep getting more and more brain damage. I don't have any brains left to damage. Stop it. Hold on, I need to I need to test something. Can you slide like this forever? You can, can't you? I think I just reached a brand new like speed limit that I had never reached before. It was like 600 and something miles an hour. Yeah, so when you're when you're skating around what you want to make sure that you don't do is one, you don't want to fall into the water. And then the other thing is there's a little pocket up here. If you can stay around it though, you can just keep breaking bones forever. We are now level 202. Real quick, I wanted to get a new speed limit. All right, obliterate. I don't know what you do. Oh, we have sprung too. You know what? Sure, let's do both. And sprung. Oh yeah. Firework. Whoa! Did I just leave the board? Oh my God. Ah! <laughs> oh no. Obliterate! I have no idea what's happening! Hold on, if I time flip, do I get part of the obliterate back? Oh my god, you do! Dart! No idea where that came from. Revert! <laughs> Might as well just throw everything we have at the problem, because why not? You know? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. 1.3 million bones. I just went out of the board, into a different board, past that board, and then I fell into the moon. <laughs> well, at this point, I think I've broken the game enough for my own satisfaction. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Broken Bones 4. Till the next time, stay foxy, a bunch of love. All right, we're checking out the only game where you can take a basketball and dunk on top of God himself. It's Super Dunk Simulator. Super Dunk Simulator is a simple game that starts on Earth where you can dunk and gain small amounts of power and wins. We're not doing that. This place literally goes up to the clouds. Actually, the very first stage is Earth and then it goes to the clouds and then it goes to the moon and I don't know what this is. It's, this must be the kingdom of heaven. And so as usual, we're going to turn small numbers into ridiculously large numbers, probably into the billions. Now you can see right here, there's a frenzy going on. You can go and with your amazing $5 Floridian shorts, you can grab all of the the different frenzy tokens to increase your strength. Then you can dunk even higher. Ugh. But what would happen if we start doing various amounts of multiplication? Uh, yeah, auto collect. I promised you all a one way ticket to heaven and that's where we're going. Well, I guess it's two way. You don't have to stay up there if you don't want to. In fact, if you want to just get off at the moon, you probably could. The best part about the auto collect is while I'm buying all of this other, while I'm wasting my money, basically, I am collecting all of the different items in the background with no effort on my part. I really enjoy that. I like how somehow you can get chakra from dunking a basketball. Sure. Okay, so at this point, with all of the different upgrades, we're already jumping to the 125 stud area. I'm like a hoover for upgrades. What's inside of the earth chest? I have no idea what just happened. I got abused by a ton of numbers. Okay, so at this point now, we're going to the 150 stud area. I don't even need to dribble anymore. It's just, it's too annoying to continue. You can see, before when we were upgrading, you know, maybe 
maybe one or two points at a time. We're getting 32 at a shot now. Yes, give me my upgrades. Actually, give me all the upgrades. So now it's at 57 per dunk, but I'm I'm not quite at the clouds yet. I'm not sure I want to leave Florida. That's the problem. Dribbling was something I never should have put any effort in in life. My mother lied to me. Ugh. She was like, young Florida man, you must do two different things. Go to school for engineering and also dribble as much as possible. Sorry, mom. Dribblings for squares. Is, is, the, is the hoop exploding when I hit it? It's almost like it catches on fire for a moment. Welcome to Frenzy, where all of your ridiculous numerical dreams come true. All of the numbers are increased a lot. 200 per hoop now, 260. Look at the numbers. <laughs> oh my God. 461 now per jump. Per, and that's like times four. These are my pets. I'm really concerned that two of them are just called Golden Parrot and they look like they are crying. Is that the mouth or is this chicken like vomiting blood? Whatever. The most powerful one you can get is this golden monkey. Uh, do do you always have a gigantic menagerie of, of pets just looming behind you? Wow, I'm unlocking new hoops real fast. Uh, I'm getting the things from all the way over here, all of the upgrades. I don't even have to move. You can auto dunk. Like, you don't even have to do anything. You can just leave your... Yep, sure. Oh, my God. <laughs> yes. I love that the pets just follow me. Well, you guys have absolutely no fear, do you? Uh, yeah, whatever the next upgrade is. Plus 250%. How many of these pets am I allowed to have? I don't know. I'm going to click this button a lot. If there's one thing I love, it's all of my animal friends that get to sit here and watch as I disappoint my parents. So now when I... Oh, my God. When I get the upgrades now, it's about 5,000. It's like 5,000 per upgrade and the jump. There we go. <laughs> so now we've unlocked the cloud level. Okay. Look at the numbers with the upgrades. 5,000, 4,000. What is this? You know what? Sure, whatever. What, what do these ones do? Looks like an ice cube with wings. Grab the cloud's chest. Okay. You, what? Do I even care about that? It was like 700 power. I think I'm, I don't even know how much power I'm getting at a time. One million wins? What's well, like, it's like four million wins. Can I like just jump back down to earth? Can I just fall? Oh, yep, you can just jump, but not to your death. It is a nice, soft, smooth landing. I need to get this last upgrade, okay? I've got the crowns for it. I can just, I can just upgrade two levels right away. I'm only jumping about 700 feet in the air now, but I am getting, you know, like 20 million wins per jump, which is nice. Oh, sorry, did I say 20 million? I meant like 40 million now. And the next hoop is immediately upgraded. I, that was 21 million per shot at this point. Okay, we can get our next upgrades. We can jump to our, well, what would be our death? My ball is also glowing green now. It has the power of earth. I'm eventually going to get infused with all of the different elements. I love that the basketball is happy as well. The basketball is like, thank you, Gray. You fed me my favorite meal, money. All right, murder me and rebirth me. It's not really a big deal because we unlock the new hoops in like two seconds. I've got to get my animals out of here. We'll just assume that they're around me. It's like I'm a human school bus. Okay, so we buy the upgrades all over again, which now is starting to multiply with the rebirths. I do one jump now and the next upgrade is available. One single dunk. All right, we've already maxed that out. All right, the new level is immediately unlocked. And then the extra flip to get up here. Welcome to the clouds. I guess we'll get to the next level and then we'll do the next rebirth. Again, one dunk is worth about 25 million, which allows us to immediately get the upgrade, which allows us to immediately unlock tons of new hoops where we can immediately get the next upgrade. <laughs> when do the numbers like kind of level out? They don't, do they? This just gets more and more insane. I never thought that my physical prowess at something like basketball would allow me to have an audience with God. We are now getting 72 million wins per dunk. I am, I'm, I'm starting to leave the light of the sky. I am literally going into space. I'm gonna have to start dodging asteroids. We're at 1.44 billion wins. This is nowhere near enough. What do I, what do I have to do in order to rebirth again? We're gonna keep merging. Uh, do I have to jump on a cloud? Oh, you absolutely do. Yeah, sure, merge, merge whatever. What do we got? I don't even have to jump to earth. I can just go through the portal. Uh, yep, can absolutely rebirth. 
Got that quick. So now 104 million to rebirth. Sure. Unlock new hoop. Look at it. <laughs> Oh my god! Yay! I'm unlocking hoops right now that I haven't even gotten to. Like, I have to get to the next level. We've already gotten that far. And, like, look, look at the amount of hoops that are just getting unlocked. I think I'm already on, I don't know, like, hoop 10 or something, and I didn't even do anything yet in this- Yeah, look at how high already! If I'm still breathing air, and I haven't gotten into the vacuum of space, it's not far enough yet. That's one billion wins. All right, fully unlocked. Now we need, I think it was something stupid, like 105 million for the next rebirth. Just because the multiplication never stops, we need to keep doing this. Until my mustache is so long that I can strangle my Myself with it. Also, Peter Plays being up there, besides having a name vaguely similar to mine, has to be lonely. Okay, am I, am I touching the cla- uh, am I touching the asteroids yet? Almost there! 4.9 billion! Alright, let me go grab the other rebirth. Can I just jump off the entire board? I feel like you almost could. Yep, give it to me. What's crazy is dribbling now is giving me 92, like, per dribble. It's almost worth it to do. Well, we already unlocked the new level. I've been at it for about 45 seconds. You can see just from the second level of this, we're getting, like, almost a million per dunk. All right, fully maxed out. All right, I want to get to our next level, space, before we do any more rebirths. Because I think if we can get even more ridiculous pets, this will go even faster. I have to fall through the clouds to land in front of the upgrades to get the final upgrade to unlock the new hoop that I haven't even touched yet. Give me them asteroids! Oh, yeah. I have to fall so far that it takes forever to the upgrade- for the upgrade stars to get down to Earth for me to absorb. Okay. Are we- are we touching the asteroids yet? Just about! Oh, we are! Welcome to space! Oh my god. Yeah, sure. Give me whatever these are. Go ahead. Oh boy. I've got like the Archangel, Michael. He's one of my pets. Golden space! I thought it said golden space, Karen! That would have been amazing if it did. Ah, yes. The mighty space, Karen. Okay, so what do the numbers become now? So if we- if we're jumping... Oh! 7.3 billion per hit! 67 billion, okay, let's see what the next one is. A uh, hundred and eleven billion, mm-hmm. There's so many upgrades available. I've got to get the upgrades, but there's also a frenzy going on, which I don't want to miss. Okay, I can- I can see- I can taste heaven. It's right there. One hundred and f- Five hundred and one billion wins! Immediately to nine hundred and sixteen billion wins! Oh, give me that frenzy. Oh, that's the stuff. Uh, yeah, I think we have enough to upgrade these. 4.7 trillion wins to upgrade the next one. Now when we- when now when we dribble, 37 million power. Okay, so we're getting 120 billion per dunk right now, but we can go ahead and upgrade that immediately. Now we're getting 211 billion per dunk, okay. 3.14 trillion wins. Oh, I forgot to get the space chest. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I assume at this point I can probably get my next rebirth. In order to beat the top person, we have to get at least 119 billion power. You got it! Am I gonna get an upgrade on, like, my very first dunk? Yeah, I think we just got an upgrade on our very first dunk. And by an upgrade, I think I mean all the upgrades. Yep. I'm pretty sure that a bear is dunking with me. This is a very- is that, a, like, a banana? It could also be a corn dog. I'm really not sure. All right, already upgraded. We're already going to the next level like so. Here we go. The new level is now unlocked. That didn't really take very long at all. So we're already up in space. One dunk in space will probably allow us to get our next upgrade. Uh. Okay, we've already got the most rebirths, but we still don't have the most power. And I still have to get to the kingdom of heaven. Fortunately, every single time I slam the basketball, it's half a trillion in wins. Okay, the last upgrade in space is now available and the frenzy's going. So every time we pick up any one of these little frenzy items, it's like 500 and something million power. So two trillion wins up to, oh my God, eight trillion. We don't need average math where we're going. It takes me like half a minute just to fall to the ground now. 
Look at how high, like how ridiculously high the jump is. I'm technically dunking like 85 baskets at a time because I have to fall through all of them. And I forget, I don't even know how many this is. It's like 10. Okay, we're getting very close to heaven. You won't be alone anymore, Peter. The Florida man is coming to heaven. Oh, there's like two baskets left. Oh, my, my, my ball is now just a violent color of red. That's great. Just dribbling now. 112 million. <laughs> One basket left. I love that I can dribble in midair. Like, I'm dribbling on nothing. I'm just dribbling on the gravity itself. I'm already defying gravity, and now I'm just dunking on it. So, getting about 20 trillion per jump. Oh, welcome to heaven! <laughs> okay, let me stop dribbling for a moment so I can take a look at what's- Oh my god, why is all this just laying around? Upgrades. Uh, yep. I, ha I have a lot of stuff just laying around, man. Go over here to the heaven chest! <laughs> oh my god! All right, now I'm gonna go absolutely nuts with the heaven pets. So now what do you get when you dunk? Is it like a lot or- Because we're at uh, 121. <laughs> What is this? I don't know. Alright, yeah, okay. <laughs> what is this number? Oh my god. Um okay, so now I have to beat the power, I guess. So two quadrillion I'm sorry, two point nine quadrillion. Twenty two quadrillion. I have left the map. I am literally jumping past the map. I'm gone. I've left the entire game. <laughs> I've maxed out all of the upgrades. When I jump. You can no longer see my name. It takes me forever to fall down, too. All right, we're at 21 billion, but we still need more. Wow, 10 quadrillion per dunk. Well, it's actually 10 quadrillion times like four or something. Because if we're at 144 quadrillion, I, I have to wait 10 minutes to levitate up to, to space. Well, I'm not past space, I'm past heaven. I'm gonna end up in the matrix. We're getting about 40 quadrillion. We're at 88 billion. I'm sorry, 89 trillion. We're at 123 million. I'm almost there. And then we can finally dunk out of this entire plane of existence. There it is, 131 trillion. Now we can finally dunk past the clouds. We can dunk past space. We can dunk past heaven, and then finally, we can dunk completely out of this plane of existence, which takes forever because of how long you have to rise up into the sky. Yes! Well, I played basketball, stood on the golden clouds of heaven, found out they weren't real, and then fell completely off of the map. And hey, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Super Dunk Simulator. Till the next time, stay foxy and much love. All right, we're checking out the only game where literally the worst choice you can make in your life is growing up. It's growing up. So growing up is a game where you basically start as a strand of DNA and you're forced to go through life by completing different missions that will probably either get you or the people around you killed. In the end, you end up learning that life stops when you're not smart enough to complete any more tasks. And the tasks are absolutely ridiculous. Let's do this. This is me as a child. I still have a full mustache. I was born with these sunglasses. In fact, I was born with this entire outfit. Where's my alligator at? So who are these people? Are these like people that I too can be just like? All right, they're swimming randomly in the air. That's good. I love how you can have like a profession or you can get married, but you can't have both. Stand here to preview growing tall. Do I want to do this? Oh. All this did was stretch my body. I'm the same person. Literally the same person. One of the best things in this game is to look at the different text, which says things like, hi, meatball. I mean, friend. Is the other kid's name meatball or is that his designation? Like as a food source for this other kid. I feel like playing on the swings is a great way to die. So what happens if I stand like directly behind? I can stop this person's fun. That's awful. I'd like to take the opportunity to mention that the cat, let me see if I can get a, the, the cat is amazing. The dead fishbowl eyes of this animal is, my, is probably my favorite thing right now. I want to buy this cat. Where do I get it from? All right, push. Sure. How many times do I have to do this? Like, is this, a, is this oh my God. Okay. All right. Yeah, let's, uh, hey, ho. You know what? Fine. This is how we're doing this. 
That girl is just, she's been on these swings her whole life. She's just not leaving. Ah! So wait, what are my options? Fly like Cupid. Is this something that you learn how to do at five years old? Yep. Sure do. I have no idea why a child can evolve to do this. Cupid wings. Sure. Oh my god. Look up to fly. Hold right mouse button. Okay. And then you can just murder people? Why? Hey, you think you can have fun on my watch? Get sniped. So what happens? Does he like fall in love with the floor now? Because he just hit it really hard. Can I just leave the entire game? Can I just, can I just go? My favorite thing right now is that there's no limitation on where you fly with this, so you can just leave. <laughs> bye, bye! Yeah, I guess I'll just pop up from the under- Oh god! Uh, I'm stuck in the sludge of the underworld, I can't get out! All right, I'm gonna take these angel wings off because they're gonna end up getting me killed. All right, yeah, fast bunny, sure. So is this like a pet or am I eating this and then gaining its bunny powers? Fireworks, uh-huh. Giving a five-year-old fireworks is a fantastic idea. All right, yeah, let's turn on our bunny- Oh, this is the stuff. Oh my god! <laughs> this is the stuff of nightmares! <laughs> I love that your character does like the yeehaw. He's like, yeehaw! Hold on, I've gotta jump inside this car. Don't leave! <laughs> Take me with Oh, never mind. Maybe I don't want to be in the car with you. This is amazing. Both me and the bunny are riding in this car together. Now, part of his head has fused Ooh. through the front of the seat, which is slightly perturbing. Oh, he's got the dead-eyed dog, too! The fact that this person is legitimately trying to park perfectly makes me feel so happy for the future of this world. Look at the effort they put into parking. That is great! I still have to go play on the merry-go-round. I'm only five years old still, but somehow I've tamed a chocolate bunny. I can't use this with the bunny. Nope, never mind. You can totally use it with the bunny. Hey, bunny, how are you feeling? He's like, sick. Oh, happy birthday! You level- Oh my god, what happened? I don't know what just happened there. Go to your home for your party. I don't know where my house is. In fact, where are my parents? How come I'm just allowed to do whatever I want? Can I just take this person's bike? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Driving a bike in this game is the worst thing you could ever hope to do in your life. This is, oh my God. This is the most infuriating object in the whole entire game. Oh, I live at Leeds Avenue. That's great. Oh yeah, there we go. You're gonna close the garage on me? Are you serious? What happened to my bunny? I guess the bunny's not invited to the party. Inside we go. Yay, all my friends are here. Buddy, friend, bro, sis. I'm glad that no one has any names. They all just have designations in their life that like, as, as it pertains to me. Sit in the chair, click on your present, get a basketball. Can I eat the cake at all? I can click on it. Oh, did I, did anyone get any cake or did I just eat it all? Wait, it's his birthday too? But I'm sitting in his seat. Can he have his birthday without the seat? I love that the other thing that you get for your birthday is an entire turkey. So how skillful is it to dribble on a turkey? Because that's legit what's happening right now. All right, what? All right, I guess we don't need doors where we're going. Can I have the skateboard? Sweet. Oh, this is, whoa, this is super safe. Shoot some hoops, stand on the footprints and click hoop. You got it. Am I not allowed to do this on the skateboard? All right, ready, aim, fire, huh. I'm amazing. Good shot. You're thirsty. Get Bloxade from the store. Bloxade? Is it like filled with carcinogens? Also, can I drive a car at six years old? Like, does it matter? You must pass your driving test? Luckily, I have a high octane bunny. Yay! Oh, God! <laughs> the driving teacher just got murdered. I love that the driving teacher hit me and the driving teacher was the one who died. Go inside, you got it. I love that it teaches me everything I need to do in order to pass life. What do they sell inside the block store? Dish soap, vinegar, flashlights, gigantic compasses, hydrogen peroxide, tennis rackets. This is the oddest store. Open the fridge door, get a speed boost. Can I only have one? Can I have them all? I want lots of speed boosts. Oh, it's my birthday again. Why is there a, why is there a fire outside of the gas station what happened while i was gone oh this person is cooking alive uh we doing this we're just gonna let this burn you guys just chilling out over here watching the fireworks that was a fire extinguisher can i not use it do i not have the skill can i take yep yeah. oh oh i could totally use a fire extinguisher six year old to the rescue I'm a fuck! <laughs> oh god somebody put me out i love how i saved 
this entire gas station and everyone around me just watched me burn alive. Yeah, you know what? Come here. There, you can all experience unending heartache. <laughs> wow. I guess, I guess shooting a bunch of love arrows at people actually does have consequences. Notice how most of the vehicles in the direct line of sight are fully flipped over. Look at this. I don't think that the Roblox driving school is working at all. <laughs> The best part about the bunny is I, it doesn't flip randomly and murder me. Oh my God, what happened? You guys need to get a bunny, for real. Yay, it's me again. Did I get any new friends? No, it's the exact same friends. Oh, I got a pet. Where? Oh, oh no. Oh God, no. Hold on, we need to go out in the light for you to fully appreciate this. <laughs> my cat needs a name. Your name is Trauma. Trauma the cat. That's what you have. That's what you're giving me as I look upon you. All right, Trauma, let's go on the trampoline. Trauma's like, the last time I was on the trampoline, my entire family got slain. Yeah? I mean, I can't really promise you that anything better is going to happen when I'm involved, but oh, hey, a grill. Oh, you can kind of open the grill, but like just barely. Hold on, I want to see if I can put the cat inside the grill. I, that sounds terrible. I just want to know if it's possible. There we go. This is safe. All right, trampoline time. Whoa. Oh my God. Oh, this is a- hold on. I gotta aim for the house. Yeah! Like Santa Claus, I'm gonna come down the chimney. Time for school! This is- it's on fire again! <laughs> oh, there's so many people burning alive! This is the most amazing life a child could possibly have. Like 10 minutes into being born, and I've already experienced, I don't know, maybe like 12 brushes with death. I am gonna be so prepared for any problems that life could throw at me. Most of the people I've met have already burned to death. Bring your bunny to school day. Joe has four bags with nine candies. How many candies does Joe have? What happens if I, if I get it wrong? Do I go back, like in, in my age? I'm gonna say 27, I wanna know what happens. Oh, I actually can't pick the wrong answer. <laughs> like it is forcing me to pick the right answer. I answered one question and I passed the entire first grade. A boy has swallowed some coins. His mom took him in the, to the hospital. Later, dad asks the nurse for an update and the nurse says no change yet. <laughs> this game hurts. Sometimes I, I find myself in great pain at the level of, well, one, everyone being set on fire, and two, the amount of dad jokes that there is. Hey, it's my birthday again, everyone. Did you even leave? Like, did anyone even step outside of the house? I got a bicycle. I mean, technically I already had a bicycle. I just stole someone else's bicycle. How, what, what is, this is not how you ride a bicycle. This is not at all how you ride a bicycle. What is happening? Barbara, why am I intentionally trying to die? Ride your bike. Okay. It seems like a great idea. My bike, okay. Yep. That was my neck just then. Broke my neck, it's fine, I have another one. We got plenty of necks where that came from. Through the arrow, jump to get over the curbs. Okay, seems like a great idea. And can I drink this while I have my bike out? Oh, tell me I can. Oh yeah. Oh, now we're fueled. Now we're fueled with the power of electrolytes. All right, here we go. Jump the curb, perfect. Jump the curb. Tokyo Drift. Like, no joke, you actually do, like, Tokyo Drift on this bicycle. Look at this. I love that my cat drifts, too. <laughs> Ride bike to the playground. Okay. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta drink more power grade. Hey, Trauma, how you doing? He's like, still hate my life. All right, just checking. I remember this playground. Ride to the top of Little Bike Park or walk. The playground was where I had my... <clears throat> the playground is where I had my first brush with death. Uh, uh -huh. Wait, do I have to ride on this thing or can, can I just use my wings and fly up here? Uh, you can, you don't have to do anything. You leveled up, go to, go home for your party. Yay. Was it just me or did I come over here and there was a car like parked on top of a different car? You got a new pet. Oh, okay. I love that at nine years old, your family trusts you enough with a constantly fire making device that they just perch it onto your shoulder and now he's like your best friend. You know what, we're going over to the gas station. Since you breathe fire, could you legitimately set the entire gas station ablaze? I know, it's kind of sad that that's my very first question I have for this creature. How about if I run a bunny into this? Huh, maybe everything isn't as flammable as I thought it was. Oh, I got a boomerang. What sort of havoc can I do with this? Go to the front yard, throw the boomerang, then catch it. I wanna throw it at a car. 
I heard someone driving out here. Someone who wasn't on fire yet. All right, I guess I'll throw it at the sky. Oh, wow. Okay. Are you coming back or are you just going straight to the, like, the next planet? This boomerang. Whoa! I love that the boomerang and gravity have nothing to do with one another. In case you're wondering, I got a skateboard and I still have the boomerang. I still haven't found anyone to murder with the boomerang yet, but don't worry, I'll keep my eyes out. I love that sideways grinding on my scalp. I just... <laughs> I just ran, I just rode through Giant Skate Park and it launched me up and then it murdered me. I love that you can also ride your rabbit here. You don't need to ride the skateboard at all. The rabbit's a lot safer too, because I, the one time I tried my skateboard, I got immediately killed. Look at this, giant jump from the rabbit. Ready, 360. I can do a lot of skating practice at 10 years old. I got a teleporter, which is basically just like a giant spaghetti strand. I'll show you what it looks like in a minute. You basically get attacked by, like, a, a, an 80-foot rope of macaroni. I got a slingshot. Let's try it out. Come here, other child. Can you do a drive-by with a slingshot inside of a car? You cannot. It makes me so depressed. Where does it want me to try this thing out? In the backyard? I thought it, was, it wants me to try it out in the living room? You have to kill the gophers with a slingshot? Oh, I'm so sorry. I love that this this slingshot has like a rapid fire capability. All right, so you have to feed the pets at the pet shop. Pet shop, spaghetti, right there. Yep, just a typical day at high school. You good? Perfect, 10 out of 10 parking job. Oh, you can trade your pets. Well, I'm not getting rid of trauma. That sounds terrible. What do we got over here? Oh my God, what is that? Oh, it's glorious. It's like a dollar store seagull. This seagull has been through so much. Hey seagull, if you stick around with me, I'm probably gonna end up crashing my car into the gas station. The seagull's like, good. I think that's what this is. I really don't know. I love that I have a cat and a bird and you're both gonna eat dog food. Feed the dogs outside. Is that, oh. This isn't my animal. Why do I care if they get fed or not? You've got poo on your feet. Go home and wash. Hey, Trauma, do you like your new friends? Trauma's like, I don't like anything. Excellent. Home we go. I love that in order to wash my feet off, I have to trapeze the excrement through the entire house. Yep, just showering with all of my clothes on. All right, next stage. All right, so I get to choose a dog now. Let me see my options. All right, looks, looks very doji. Uh-huh. All right. Oh, looks very loyal. Look at the blue eyes. <laughs> What is happening over here? <laughs> Looks psychotic. This is my perfect dog. Oh, you're coming with me. Oh, I love it. The dog just dies every couple of seconds. He's like, Ugh. <laughs> why? <laughs> why do I have to get my dog a Frisbee? He's having enough fun just falling. All right, I'll get a Frisbee, I guess. I'm literally like a Minecraft person. I <laughs> oh, thank you. Hold on, I gotta do this again. <laughs> Go get it. Look at him try. Uh, oh, I think he's gone. I think my dog. Oh, hold on. He got it. He's come. Whoa! <laughs> this is the best animal I could have ever gotten in life. Your name is Hypertension, the dog. You got camping gear. What? Where did this come from? Oh, we don't. Oh, wow. Yeah, we don't climb things. I have a rabbit made out of demon chocolate. This is how I get from point A to point B. There you go. Yeetus. Perfect. Grab your tent and click a level area nearby. I love that my dog is still here with me and he's still in his murder pose. Hey, hypertension, what's your favorite food? He's like, gasoline. Uh, what is this? Am I supposed to do something about this or? Uh, okay. <laughs> I love that the tent just falls out of the sky. Grab some firewood. <laughs> Throw the dog on the fire pit. That was odd. Hey, hypertension. Don't go on the fire pit while I'm trying to build a fire. Stop it. Stop. All right, you know what? It's your funeral. Whatever. <laughs> See what happens? See what happens when you touch an open flame? He's like, you die and then you get resurrected like the phoenix. Roast a marshmallow. Do I have marshmallows? I don't remember packing those. Also, why am I being allowed to camp alone at like 13? Oh, I do have marshmallows. Time to get some rest. Okay, I don't, oh, well, hi. I'm not so much sleeping. I'm doing one-handed push-ups. This is odd. Pick up your tent. Stop eating. Get the tent. The sound effect. All right, go ahead and drown real quick. 
Yeet. I love how the cat swims. It just swims with its tail coming out of the water. It's like a little shark. It's like the shark fin. Oh yeah, hypertension's having a great time. Look at him go. How you doing, bird? The bird's like, I'm drowning. Excellent. Glad we're all having such a good time. You hear a strange sound coming from that mountain, right? It sounds like some sort of creature. Oh, this is great. I'm not going in there. I'm absolutely going in there. All right, take out the lantern. Oh, it's a raptor. I love how in this neighborhood, there's just like a random dead-eyed raptor chilling out in a cave at the edge of the city. How you doing, raptor? The raptor's like, well, I'm hungry. I mean, you can eat hypertension, but he'll probably give you a heart attack. Oh, the, the raptor has a thorn in its foot that you have to remove. He looks friendly now. See if you could ride him. This is so strange. Okay, yep, this is this is happening. Oh wow, I'm just glitching through the board. Ride him outside. See how high he can jump, yeah. Ride him to school to prove he's not extinct. My favorite thing would be if this raptor can like eat people. What is going on over here? Hey, hey, yeah. Yeah, that's what happens, man. You can literally grab people and eat them. You're coming with me. He's like, I already graduated elementary school. Too bad you're going back. That's right, Saitama. Time for math. Oh, it's, it's, it's my birthday. I love not only do I get the person, but I get his pet too. So, oh, where'd he go? Come back. I don't want a birthday alone. Come here, bride. Come here. Fantastic. Giving me this raptor was literally the worst thing this game could have ever done. You get a paintball membership. <laughs> I just ate both of those people. Did you see that? They both just disappeared. You guys allow raptors over at the paintball arena? I don't see a sign that says you don't. Must be 14 or older. How old are you? Raptors like over 20 million years old. Perfect. Choose a color. Oh, well, the raptor's green, so we're picking green. Shoot the target. Oh, you can do this on the raptor. Oh yeah, what am I shooting at? Oh, you can kind of aim, it's just almost impossible on the raptor. I'm shooting the raptor in the back of the head. Oh, there we go. Yeah! I don't need to open the door. I'll jump over the door. Open the door. Shoot the target to open the next door. We don't need to! I have a raptor! I love that because of this raptor, I can just cheat the entire board. Go to the yellow square without getting shot. Shoot the robot. Ow! There we go. Hitting the robot is almost impossible because, like I said, the aiming is so jacked up. Oh, do I have to do this off the Velociraptor? I hate leaving this thing behind. Oh, you can actually get carried in his mouth. All right, back onto the Raptor. Pick a team. Green. Capture the opposing team's flag. Well, that's easy. Again, I can just jump over the glass. Boom. We win. 15 years old. I got a car. Now the true havoc begins. Oh, you gotta pass the driving test first. Is this like a question thing or? All right, go ahead. When a traffic light turns yellow, what should you do? <laughs> Speed up. This is the first car that you get. Yeet it! <laughs> you hit someone. All right, continues to the stop sign. Stay in the car. Can I just go through this? This car is insane. Look at it. <laughs> I love how it just rams stuff. Yeet it! <laughs> Says go into the gas station. Get the car very close to any gas pump. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, it was only a matter of time. Uh, hold on, there's one left. Yeah. Oh, it's stuck in the car. Oh, man. I can't really say I'm that sorry. I love that she's on fire as well. She just walks straight through the flames. Here, let me show you. They should have stand right in front of him. That was scary. No, it wasn't. That was awesome. Ah, my died. <laughs> Lucky your parents had insurance. Here's your driver's permit. You really want to give me a driver's permit after that? I love how you set most of the neighborhood on fire and your driving instructor on fire. And they're like, yeah, it's good enough. I got a cell phone. Oh, this is amazing. Avoid the rocks. How about the snails? Oh, you have to murder the snails? I feel kind of bad about that. Got it. Send a text message. My dog drinks gasoline. Send. Everyone liked that. I don't know how I made it to high school. I honestly have no clue how I lived this long. Martial arts. I will perform seven moves. Then you will repeat them. Bow. Block. Punch. What about blow things up? I did it. Like, first try. Punching bag. That was I bow into the bag a lot. 
I love that you do hit the bag if you bow into it. <laughs> like it moves the bag ever so slightly. Time for gymnastics training. Can I just click all these? Yeah, just that. There we go. Perfect. Mm-hmm. This is normal. Oh my god. What was okay? Boom. I'm pretty sure I just cap away a kicked my dog somehow. Did I win? I love that my dog's trying to do the moves too. I did it. Success. He's he's fine. <laughs> I literally have to build a robot. Build a robot. Torso, arms and legs, screwdriver. Is this what happens in high school? I don't remember anyone get, like having enough faith in me to build a robot. So can my robot like eventually attack humans or how does this work? I can just run my robot into the wall forever if I want. I had to program this robot and see if it followed my instructions correctly. And while I'm trying to do this, this girl's- No, I don't want- Stop with your fire- Stop breathing fire on my robot! Now let's upgrade your robot. Did he get a laser on his eyes? I don't know if that's a good idea. I mean, we're absolutely doing it. Drill. Laser beam eyes. Glue. Heart. Please defeat the crazy robot outside. Why did it turn into this? How come learning robotics ended- Oh my god. Ow! Ow! Will it, like, blow up the car if I hide behind the car? <laughs> Alright, so I have to use my robot to defeat the other robot. So just kind of walk him on over. Look at him, he's looking at the bigger robot, and he's like, You're just like me! Now die! I said die! It worked surprisingly well. You saved the school. Don't ask how we got here. This is... It's- my arm is inside of my solar plexus. I'm at my high school graduation. Why am I the only person here with a gigantic rabbit? Yeah, Sarah, go ahead and say something for the good of the class. Do I have to sit around and listen to this? <laughs> I love that you can just set off a firework right in the middle of graduation. Oh, it's not going anywhere. It's just kind of like chilling out. Oh, it is inside of one of the teachers. Yep, that's normal. Everyone's blinded now. Your turn. You got it. Proceed with pride. <laughs> I gave that up a long time ago. I'm 18. I got a motorcycle. Well, I got part of a motorcycle because the previous owner crashed into the mountains and died. I love that the parts of the motorcycle are in the trees. What happened to the person who had this motorcycle last? Am I sure I want to be fixing this? One of the motorcycle parts is at the bottom of the lake. I have a motorcycle now. This seems like a great idea. First things first, can the motorcycle set things on fire? Survey says it cannot. On the side note, though, it could just it rides straight up walls. I have to go to the help wanted boards. Can I just be unemployed? Oh, someone left their raptor behind. You're hired. I'm working on a farm. There wasn't even an interview. I just got hired. Feed the chickens. You chickens like fireworks? I love how using the fireworks just changes the entire environment. Oh, I think I. Am I murdering the chickens or am I feeding them? I can't tell. Oh, chicken feed. This one chicken does not want to listen. Hey, stop it. Uh, you only have like two frames of movement. Get in here. Come on, everyone. There you go, inside the chicken coop. This is where you will spend the rest of your lives. Use the horse to chase the cows. Oh, okay. I love how you can Tokyo Drift with the horse, too. This is incredible. Get in there. No one gets to enjoy the outdoors. I'm absolutely not using this to plow the fields. I'm going to use this to plow the chickens. <laughs> ah, I'm sorry! I feel kind of bad. I thought it would do more damage. I got accepted into college, apparently. Who's paying for all of this? Why is there a horse? I mean, I guess I'm driving a chocolate bunny, so I really shouldn't ask those kind of questions. I'm surprised there's not a dinosaur here. I have like an extra guy following me around and I can't get rid of him. This is my dorm room, Brad, get out. I love that my dorm room came with a free stalker. It says there's someone at the door. No, there's someone, oh my, why? <laughs> Brad just got thrown into the sky. I'm now 19, I have two more years to live. I got a magic wand that vomits out horses. Now I understand how the horse got here. I love that you can also murder the guy with the horse. Just a normal day, running on the treadmill with my deadly coral snake. The snake's been trying to eat Brad for the last 10 minutes or so. Brad is fairly tough though. For some reason, he's very poison resistant. I went to the gym for 30 seconds and this is what I look like now. I look like I ate myself. There's basically two of me. I'm going into the mountains with my friend Cola. I think I know now 
why two people were flying overhead getting mauled by a dragon. A few seconds later. Show your parents how your dragon has been growing up. I love how this is a normal part of, of like childhood, like growing into a young adult, is having your girlfriend hanging from the talons of your deadly dragon. Yep. Just, I love how trauma is still here too. That cat never leaves me. I'm so glad. It's good to know that I'll never get rid of my trauma. Oh boy. Oh, yep, this is normal. Dragon is teleporting through the ceiling. Sounds good. Pick up some passengers. Oh, it's a surprise party. I'm murdering everyone. I am so sorry. Can I click my present? I just needed to level up. I don't even know where my character is. I'm like under the floor. I am legitimately stuck inside of the table. I am inside of the table. Oh. I can't, I can't age up anymore. I'm the final age. Well, you know what to do when you finally get to your 21st birthday. Murder! Well, I started my life on fire and I'm literally ending my life on fire. This is the most realistic life experience game I've ever played. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Growing Up to the next time. Stay foxy, much love.